My beloved child, listen very carefully. You've probably been feeling it for a while now, an intense longing, a desire so powerful it almost consumes you. You've been dreaming about someone, feeling their presence in a way that's almost too real to be a dream. This message is for you, and if you stay until the end, you will finally understand what this dream truly means and why your heart feels like it's burning with such intense desire. Child of my heart, if you need my touch upon your life, speak it boldly. Type yes I need, and know that I, your Savior, am here to bless you abundantly. You see, my beloved, this dream isn't just a random figment of your imagination. It's not some fleeting thought that you can dismiss as mere fantasy. This intimate dream is a message, a reflection of something much deeper happening within your spirit. It's a sign that something profound is stirring in your life. But before we dive into the deeper meaning of this dream, you need to understand a few things. Let me explain step by step what's truly happening, why you're feeling this way, and what I want you to do about it. My child, Desire is one of the most powerful forces I've placed within you. It moves you, shapes you, and drives you toward the things that matter most in your life. But desire is not always easy to understand. Sometimes it feels overwhelming, uncontrollable even. You've been feeling this intense longing for someone, and it's been haunting you in your dreams. You wake up, and their face is the first thing on your mind, isn't it? You feel this deep pull toward them, almost as if they were meant to be part of your life. But listen closely to me now, desire is a double-edged sword. It can lead you toward great love, great fulfillment, or it can consume you if not understood properly. The dream you've had is not a mistake. It's not random. This person you dream of is burning with desire for you because they see something in you. Something pure and radiant. But before you run toward them, you need to understand what this desire is really about. Let me reveal something to you, my child. Not every dream is a message to take action. Sometimes dreams reflect your inner world, your hidden thoughts, fears, and desires. This intense dream you've had, where this person is burning with desire for you, might feel exhilarating, but it's a reflection of something deeper than just romance. It's about connection, but not just with that person. It's about connection with yourself. I know you felt a longing, an emptiness at times, that you think only someone else can fill. But the truth is, my beloved, this dream is a call for you to turn inward. The intense desire you feel is a sign that you need to reconnect with your own heart. Yes, this person desires you, but the dream is showing you something about your own longing, the longing to be fully known, to be deeply loved, and to be understood. And here's the most important part, that love starts with you and me. Precious child, if my words have brought comfort and strength to your heart, express your love by tapping the like button in gratitude. You might ask, but God, why does this dream feel so real? Why does it feel like this person and I are meant to be together? My child, dreams are often a reflection of the deepest parts of ourselves. This dream feels real because it's reflecting a part of your spirit that's craving connection, not just with another person, but with your own soul and with me. The intensity of the dream is showing you the depth of your own desires, your own need for intimacy and love. Intimacy is not just physical, it's emotional, spiritual, and even divine. This dream of someone burning with desire for you is not just about physical attraction. It's about true intimacy, the kind that goes beyond the surface. True intimacy means being seen for who you truly are, without masks, without fear, and without shame. It's about being vulnerable, open, and raw. The person in your dream desires you because they see something in you that is real. They see your beauty, your strength, your heart. But I need you to understand something, my beloved. 
before you can fully receive that kind of love from someone else. You need to embrace it within yourself. You are worthy of love. You are worthy of deep connection. But true intimacy starts with knowing yourself, the parts of you that you've hidden, the parts you've been too afraid to show. This dream is calling you to open up, to allow yourself to be truly seen, not just by others, but by yourself. The flames of desire you felt in this dream are not just about romantic love. They are the flames of passion, of your own soul crying out to be awakened. This burning desire is calling you towards something greater, something more profound than a relationship with another person, is calling you to step into your purpose. You've been playing small, my child. You've been hiding parts of yourself, thinking that you're not enough, that you're not ready, that you need someone else to complete you. But this burning desire is showing you that the fire is already within you. You are complete. You don't need anyone else to validate your worth or your purpose. This desire you feel is a sign, a sign that it's time for you to step into the fullness of who you are. You might be asking, but God, what about this person? What if they are the one? My child, I see your heart. I know how deeply you feel. And yes, this person may very well play a significant role in your life. But before you run toward them, I need you to run toward me. The desire you feel, the fire burning within you, is a reflection of your soul's need to connect with me, your Creator. Let me guide you. Let me show you the way. It's easy to let desire take over, to let it blind you to everything else. You wake up thinking about this person. You go through your day replaying the dream in your mind. You wonder if they feel the same, if they are thinking about you, too. But my child, you must be careful. Desire can be a beautiful thing, but it can also consume you if you let it. My precious one, if this message has blessed you, let your light shine before others by showing your love and devotion. I don't want you to lose yourself in this desire. I don't want you to forget who you are. Remember, you are not defined by someone else's love or desire for you. You are defined by who I created you to be. And I created you to be whole, complete, and full of love, not dependent on someone else to make you feel worthy. This dream, this intense desire, is not a call to lose yourself in someone else. It's a call to find yourself, to connect with the deepest parts of your soul, and to allow that fire to fuel your purpose. Yes, this person may be part of your journey, but they are not the destination. I am your destination. Let me lead you. I know that you're eager. I know that this dream has made you feel like everything is happening now, like you need to act immediately, like this is a sign that you must run toward this person. But my child, I need you to trust the timing of your life. Everything happens in its season. Just because this dream is intense doesn't mean it's time to rush. Patience is key. Trust that I am working behind the scenes, that I am aligning everything perfectly. There's no need to force anything. If this person is truly meant to be part of your life, it will happen naturally, in my perfect timing. Trust me. You might feel like you're burning with desire right now, like you can't wait, like you need answers immediately. But I am asking you to wait. Wait on me. Wait on my timing. Don't rush into something that isn't ready. Let me prepare your heart. Let me prepare the way, my child. I want you to remember something very important. You are already deeply loved. This person may desire you, but I have loved you from the very beginning. My love for you is deeper, stronger, and more intense than anything you can imagine. You don't need to chase after love, because you already have it in me. This dream is a reminder of the love that already exists within you. The desire you feel is a reflection of the love that I've placed in your heart. So before you run toward someone else, run toward me. Let me fill you with my love, 
my peace, my joy. And when the time is right, everything else will fall into place. My child, this dream was intense for a reason. It's a call to wake up, to pay attention to the desires of your heart, to reconnect with yourself and with me. Yes, this person may be burning with desire for you, but remember, you are already complete. You don't need anyone else to define your worth. Let this dream guide you deeper into your own soul, into your own purpose. Stay with me until the end of this journey, because what you seek is already within you. You are loved, you are desired, and you are enough just as you are. Trust me, and everything will unfold exactly as it should. Beloved one, would you join me in reaching the world with my message of hope? Through buy me a coffee, your support will lift this mission higher. I see your generosity, and I bless you for your kind heart, for you are helping to shine my light. Dear soul, today, I come with a message from the blessed messengers, filled with significant disclosures and serious loose sentiments. This message touches a touchy space in your heart since the universe needs to appear you something you might have as of now felt but haven't completely caught on however. There is an individual who can no longer hold back what they feel for you, and the crave they carry in their chest is burning like, and seriously, nearly wild flame. This is the minute when the blessed messengers welcome you to tune in carefully, since what is approximately to be uncovered may alter the way you see this individual, and indeed yourself. The truth is that this individual, who may have appeared removed or impassive, is battling against a storm of feelings they can no longer control. Their heart burns with want for you. The blessed messengers appear me that in hush, they attempt to stow away this tornado of sentiments. But the more they attempt, the more grounded this want gets to be. It's as if the universe is contriving for these feelings to come to the surface, so there is no more room for questions or fears. Dear soul, Envision this individual lying at night, incapable to get you out of their contemplations. Each memory shared between you, each look traded, is show like a motion picture that rehashes in their intellect. The crave for you is not fair physical but spiritual, deet, something that rises above the standard. They feel they require to be by your side, that this association is much more than a straightforward fascination. It's a soul call something predetermined, as if you were drawn to each other by more noteworthy forces, forces that the blessed messengers are guiding. You might ponder why this individual hasn't completely opened up however, why they still keep up a few remove or delay. The blessed messengers uncover that they are battling an inner fight. There is an strongly fear of being defenseless, of uncovering themselves, and maybe getting harmed. But at the same time, the crave to be with you develops so much that it appears to devour each portion of their soul. It's as if they are on the edge of an chasm, prepared to hop, but still holding back out of fear of the unknown. The blessed messengers appear that this minute of delay is coming to end conclusion. This individual will not be able to cover up what they feel for much longer. The crave burns from the interior out, and the resistance is debilitating. Their heart cries out for you, and it's incomprehensible to deny the profundity of what is happening. They feel that each day they are closer to making an imperative choice, and this choice includes you. It's as if predetermination is planning the ground for you two to meet once more in a more genuine way, without the covers that fear and uncertainty have created. Dear soul, the blessed messengers inquire that you keep your heart open. This individual, who is being expended by this burning crave, needs time to adjust with their claim sentiments. They are starting to get it that standing up to what they feel as it were brings more torment. The blessed messengers are by their side, making a difference than discover strength, so that when the time comes, they can approach you with earnestness and clarity. This approach will be a turning point, something that can totally change the relationship between you. You may have as of now felt the signs of this change, little motions, longer looks, messages that imply it something more profound. 
All of this is a reflection of what is happening in this person's heart. They can no longer deny that they are totally taken by this want, that your nearness or non-attendance in their life decides their enthusiastic state. Presently, the blessed messengers inquire that you get ready for what is to come. There is a fire that is approximately to touch off everything you know, driving to a modern stage in your lives. This individual will not be able to stand up to much longer, and when they at long last open up, you will require to be prepared to get this truth with an open heart. Child of mine, if these words have spoken to your soul and brought light to your day, let your response be an offering of gratitude by tapping the like button. Dear soul, the universe is working in your favor, and this individual, who tries so difficult to cover up their sentiments, is on the skirt of incredible disclosure. The blessed messengers need you to know that everything that is happening is portion of a bigger arrange. This is the minute to believe the process, to accept that genuine cherish cannot be contained, cannot be hushed. As the blessed messengers uncover more around this passionate travel, the scene around you starts to change. The individual burning with one for you is going through and strongly inner prepare. It's as if something is moving profoundly inside them, driving them to confront the sentiments they have attempted to overlook or control for so long. The one they feel for you, once befuddled, presently gets to be progressively clear. They realize they can no longer elude the truth you are unpreventably display in their life. The blessed messengers appear that this grave has profound roots going past the surface of ordinary feelings. It is not fair a fleeing fascination or a passing enthusiasm. It is something greater, something that includes the soul, the heart, and indeed the soul of this individual. Each time they think of you, a fire touches off inside them, a sensation so solid that in some cases it gets to be overpowering. The unimportant thought of you brings forward strongly sentiments, and it's as if your vitality is always associated to theirs, shaping an undetectable however effective bond. Now, dear soul, the blessed messengers need you to get it that this individual is drawing nearer a significant minute in their travel. They are starting to acknowledge that they can no longer battle what they feel. The crave for you devours them more each day, and they are round to take an activity that might alter the course of this association. The time of wavering is coming to in conclusion. They know they can no longer overlook the call of their heart since it as it were brings more suffering. The blessed messengers appear that in later weeks, this individual has experienced arrangement of signs and synchronicities that make them continually think of you. It's as if the universe is sending day by day updates, reaffirming what they as of now know interior, that you are somebody special, someone they cannot lose. And the more they attempt to separate themselves, the more grounded this vitality that pulls them back to you gets to be. The universe is planning for this truth to be uncovered, so there is no more room for doubts. Now, some time recently we precede this message, compose in the comments 1111 to claim. Dear soul, you may have taken note a few changes in the way this individual acts recently. Maybe you have taken note that they are more mindful to you, looking for a way to get closer, indeed if unpretentiously. The blessed messengers uncover that they are gathering the quality to take the following step. The crave for you is so strongly that it can no longer be contained, and before long you will see this clearly in their actions. This individual is planning for a minute of disclosure. The blessed messengers appear that in spite of the fact that they have confronted fears and uncertainties, presently they are decided to confront what they feel for you straightforwardly and truly. They know that this disclosure will be transformative for both of you. The blessed messengers appear me that this truth, once at last communicated, will be like a light that will enlighten everything that has been in the shadows until now. Dear soul, the blessed messengers inquire that you moreover get ready candidly for this minute, when this individual at last opens their heart. It will be a minute of incredible helplessness. They will be putting everything on the table, appearing the most profound and most touchy parts of their soul, 
and it is up to you to choose how to respond to this disclosure. The blessed messengers recommend that you keep your heart open and compassionate, as this individual will be uncovering themselves in a way they never have before. The want they feel for you is not something that emerged out of no place. The blessed messengers uncover that there is a otherworldly association between you, something that rises above this life. You have been associated some time recently in other ventures, and the get-together of your souls presently is portion of a bigger range. That is why this individual feels such and seriously fascination for you, something they cannot clarify in judicious terms. They feel that you have a reason together, something that goes past a basic physical or enthusiastic connection. Dear soul, the blessed messengers appear me that the another stage of this association will be definitive. It will bring to light everything you have built so distant, but it will moreover open entryways to something new, something more profound and more genuine. This individual is prepared to burn the bridges of the past, clearing out behind the questions and fears that held them back. They are planning to take a jump of confidence, and the blessed messengers are directing each of their steps. If my words have touched you deeply, share your joy and let the world know that my love has reached your heart. Dear soul, be prepared to welcome this individual with open arms if it is the crave of your heart. The blessed messengers need you to know that this association has the potential to bloom in and mind-blowing way, but for that, strength and yield will be required from both sides. As this travel proceeds, the blessed messengers uncover that the minute of extraordinary change is drawing closer rapidly. The concentrated of the want this individual feels for you is coming to a level where they can no longer contain their sentiments. It's as if each moment, they require to be near to you, to share everything that is happening interior them, is developing incessantly. They know they can no longer stand up to what the universe is directing, and the blessed messengers are planning the way for this disclosure to happen in the purest and most earnest way conceivable. The blessed messengers appear that this individual, in their deepest being, has as of now started to arrange the following steps. They are reflecting on each minute you have shared, remembering recollections, and realizing that in spite of everything, you have gotten to be a basic portion of their life. The want to be with you is no longer something they can disregard, and with each passing day, they feel more decided to take activity. They know the time of faltering is over. The fire that burns interior them for you cannot be choked any longer. Dear soul, the blessed messengers uncover that there is an extraordinary inside fight happening inside this individual. On one side, there is the fear of being vulnerable, the fear of opening up totally and appearing all their blemishes. On the other side, there is the seriously, nearly overpowering a door they feel for you. The blessed messengers appear me that this fight is coming to, and conclusion since the cherish they feel for you is beginning to win. They know that you are the individual who can get it and acknowledge their vulnerabilities, and this fills them with the strength to at long last open their heart. Before proceeding the message, if you haven't subscribed to the channel, however, take the opportunity to subscribe. This makes a difference as proceed making important substance for you. Continuing the message, this individual has been guided by an arrangement of synchronicities and signs from the universe that point to you. The blessed messengers uncover that on a few events, they found themselves considering of you precisely at the minute something imperative happened maybe a tune play, reminding them of a minute you shared, or a rehashed number, like 1111, showed up as an update that your association goes past the conventional. These signs are like otherworldly affirmations that you are predetermined for something greater, something that rises above the obstructions of time and space. Dear soul, the blessed messengers need you to know that this individual in spite of the fact that they have kept their sentiments covered up for so long, is presently prepared to free themselves from this burden. What was once fear and uncertainty is changing into men critical require for truth and association. They wish to be with you in a total way, without the obstructions that once held them back. 
This want is not fair physical or enthusiastic, but a genuine otherworldly yearning to join together with you in each sense. You may have felt that this individual was removed, may be indeed detached, but the blessed messengers appear that behind this exterior, there has continuously been a profound want to be by your side. They fair didn't know how to bargain with what they felt. Presently be that as it may, everything is changing. The concentrated of the want they feel for you is constraining them to confront their feelings head on, and they know they can no longer delay the inescapable. They require to open up, they require to express everything that is put away in their heart. The blessed messengers uncover that this individual has been going through a prepare of inside mending, something that is planning them for this extraordinary minute of disclosure. They are liberating themselves from ancient wounds and from designs that anticipated them from living cherished completely. And you, dear soul, played a pivotal part in this handle. Your nearness, your light, were the fundamental impulse for them to begin changing from the interior out. The want they feel for you is a reflection of this change, verification, that they are prepared to live something genuine and profound by your side. My dear child, your giving spirit advances my work, sharing light with all the world. As you stand with me, we build a future full of hope. Press the super thanks button for the overflowing blessings I have for you. Dear soul, the blessed messengers inquire that you keep up persistence and believe. In spite of the fact that this individual is drawing close to the minute of disclosure, they still require a small time to assemble the essential boldness to open their heart totally. But the blessed messengers guarantee that this minute is coming. They know they can no longer hold back what they feel, and when they at last open up to you, it will be a minute of awesome freedom for both. The blessed messengers need you to be arranged to welcome this individual with a door and sympathy. They are approximately to uncover themselves in a way they never have some time recently, and this requires an incredible bargain of courage. When this minute comes, you will have the chance to appear them that the ador you share is solid sufficient to overcome any deterrent, any question, or fear that may still exist. Be prepared, dear soul, since what is to come is an opportunity to totally change this association. The want this individual feels for you is fair the starting of something much more prominent. The blessed messengers are directing each step, guaranteeing that your way is lit up by truth and cherish. Presently, all that remains is to hold up for the minute when this truth will at last be completely revealed. As the blessed messengers proceed to direct this travel, it gets to be progressively clearer that the minute of truth is drawing closer. This individual, who for so long battled against their sentiments, is presently around to completely surrender to the concentrated of the want they feel for you. The universe has been working to adjust all the energies around this association, planning the ground for this disclosure to happen in an important and transformative way. The blessed messengers appear that this individual has felt torn between reason and heart for a long time. They attempted to utilize rationale to legitimize the separate or hush, but presently all of that is disintegrating. The fire that burns inside them is outlandish to quench, and more and more they realize that what they feel for you is more grounded than any boundary they attempted to build. Each day, this individual feels more expended by the crave to be by your side, to at long last live this truth that has been overlooked for so long. Dear soul, the blessed messengers uncover that you are too portion of this altar. Your individual and otherworldly development amid this period was vital for this person's change. Your quality, your capacity to move forward with a door and tolerance made a secure space where they can at long last feel prepared to open up. The blessed messengers see that in spite of the fact that you have felt the instabilities and indeed questions of this travel, you never halted accepting in the control of this association. And it is absolutely this belief that is bringing you to unused chapter. This individual, who once wavered, is presently progressively mindful that they require to act. They feel that each day absent from you is a misplaced day, 
and the universe has been clear in its messages, you have something extraordinary, something that merits to be lived in completion. The blessed messengers appear that they are continually reminded of you, no matter what they do or where they are. Your nearness is like a consistent vitality, a quiet update that you are associated in a one-of-a-kind way. The blessed messengers to uncover that this individual is going through a prepare of self-discovery. The crave they feel for you is, in truth, a reflection of something much more profound. The require to reconnect with who they really are. For a long time, they remove themselves from their genuine quintessence, affected by fears, uncertainties, and outside impacts. But presently, the universe is directing them back to themselves and you. Dear soul, are a principal portion of this travel. This reconnection with their possessed pith is permitting this individual to see everything more clearly. They start to realize that the cherish they feel for you is not something that can be clarified or controlled. It is something that essentially is. And the blessed messengers need you to know that fair as they are reconnecting with their claimed truth, you are moreover being called to do the same. What you are encountering is not fair and standard cherish story. It is a travel of souls that have met to stir what is most profound and most genuine inside each one. Dear soul, the blessed messengers inquire that you stay firm in your travel. The way to this disclosure is being carefully arranged, and divine timing is continuously culminate. You may feel that things are moving gradually, but the blessed messengers guarantee you that everything is happening at the right pace. This individual needs this time to completely adjust with their sentiments so that when they at last open up to you, it is in an honest to goodness and open way. The blessed messengers too appear that this disclosure will not as it were be a minute of help for this individual, but too for you. Everything you felt, the vulnerabilities, the minutes of holding up, the signs you've gotten from the universe, all of this will adjust, bringing a sense of clarity and peace. When this individual at last communicates everything they feel for you, it will be as if a gigantic weight is lifted from your shoulders, and you will be able to begin building something unused, something that reflects the truth of this connection. My beloved child, come closer to my heart by joining this community of faith. Subscribe to receive the words of life that will lift your spirit and guide your path, for I am always with you. Dear soul, the blessed messengers need you to know that this cherish is extraordinary. It is not the kind of association that happens each day. You were drawn to each other for a more prominent reason, something that rises above time and space, and that is why this person's want for you is so seriously. They know, in their deepest being, that this association is interesting, and that standing up to it as it were brings more torment. Presently, all that remains is to permit Cherish to make its way and the blessed messengers are by your side, guaranteeing that this way is illuminated. This individual is approximately to make a move that will alter everything. They have at last caught on that the want they feel for you cannot be overlooked and that living without you is essentially terrible. The blessed messengers appear that they are gathering the quality to approach you in a way they never have some time recently, with that up to truthfulness and helplessness. When this minute comes, dear soul, you will be prepared to welcome them with an open heart, full of a door. The universe is planning an incredible astonish for you, and the blessed messengers need you to be mindful that everything is unfurling as it ought to. What is to come is the realization of something that you, on a few level, continuously knew was possible. Prepare for a capable disclosure, since this individual is burning with crave for you and they are prepared to make it clear. The travel the blessed messengers are directing has come to a basic point. Presently, you may feel that there is something in the air, and vitality of altar, an expectation that something critical is approximately to happen. The universe is moving in unobtrusive, however effective ways, adjusting everything so that this individual at long last uncovers the want that has been devouring their heart. 
This want is so seriously that they feel as if their exceptionally life is in anticipation, holding up for the right minute to express itself. The blessed messengers uncover that this individual is encountering a blend of sentiments. There is a longing to be by your side, to at long last take off, behind all fear and question, and jump at first into this association. But at the same time, there is a profound helplessness. They know that by opening up to you, they will be uncovering parts of themselves that they have kept covered up for a long time, and this brings up ancient insecurities, fears that they are not very beyond any doubt how to confront. Be that as it may, dear soul, the blessed messengers need you to know that in spite of everything, this individual has decided to take after the way of the heart. They are more mindful than ever that running from sentiments as it were draws out enduring. Each day absent from you is a day they feel the non-attendance as in terrible void. The universe has been clear in its signs. It is time to act. It is time to permit Cherish to be lived completely and truly. The blessed messengers appear that this individual has been reflecting profoundly on what you have built so distant. Indeed, if you have confronted challenges or periods of separate, they know that the association between you is not something that blurs effortlessly. On the opposite, the fire that burns inside them for you as as it were developed more grounded over time. With each memory, each thought of you, this crave increments, and they realize they require to do something approximately it. Dear soul, the blessed messengers uncover that this person's soul is moving in your course, indeed if their body and intellect still waver, on a more profound level, they have as of now chosen that you are the way they need to take after. What remains presently is for this choice to materialize in reality, and the blessed messengers are organizing occasion so that this happens in the most concordant way possible. You may have taken note that this individual has as of late given clearer signs that something is changing. Maybe there have been motions, looks, or indeed little words that imply at a more noteworthy truth. These signs are the reflection of a soul that is as of now associated to yours. Indeed, if their intellect is still preparing what this implies, the blessed messengers uncover that profound down, they as of now know they cannot live without you. They may not have communicated this in words, however, but their heart has as of now made this decision. Dear soul, the blessed messengers are planning the organize for awesome disclosure. When this individual at long last approaches you, it will be a minute of change. Everything that was covered up, everything that was curbed, will be brought to light. And in that minute, you both will have the opportunity to begin something new. Something that will be built on the strong establishment of truth and cherish. The crave this individual feels for you is not fair a passing fire. The blessed messengers uncover that this is something that was planted in their soul a long time prior. You are associated in ways you may not completely get it, however, but that the universe is starting to uncover. Each step you have taken so distant was portion of a bigger range, and presently this range is coming to its summit point. This individual has been addressing themselves a parcel lately. They ponder what will happen if they do not act, if they do not uncover what they feel, and the reply that continuously emerges is the fear of losing you until the end of time. This fear has been incredible help, something that drives them to need to resolve everything as rapidly as conceivable. They know they can no longer let time pass since time absent from you, as it were, brings more pain. My precious one, if this message has blessed you, let your light shine before others by showing your love and devotion. Dear soul, the blessed messengers inquire that you keep confidence in this handle. Everything is moving precisely as it ought to, and what is to come is something that will bring incredible fulfillment for both. This individual is nearly prepared to open up totally, and when they do, it will be a minute of extraordinary freedom. They will make clear everything they feel, all the want that burns inside them amid this time. 
it will be a minute of seriously association, where you will at long last be able to see at each other without the boundaries of fear or doubt. The blessed messengers too appear, that when this individual at long last opens up to you, they will be looking for not as it were cherish but to recovery. Thing need to appear that the time went through absent from you was a period of learning, of self-discovery, and presently they are prepared to construct something new, something that is based on regard, belief, and overall, the cherish that has continuously existed between you. Dear soul, the blessed messengers need you to plan for an unused starting. Everything you have held up for, everything you have imagined of, is approximately to materialize. This individual is burning with want for you, and before long everything that has been kept will be uncovered. The cherish you share has the potential to change your lives in ways you can't indeed envision yet. We have come to the most profound point of this travel. The blessed messengers appear me that the minute of the last disclosure is almost to happen. The individual who carries inside them this burning want for you is on the skirt of awesome change. Everything that was caught in to them, all the unexpressed feelings, are around to come to the surface. The universe has arranged the culminate setting for this disclosure to happen, and the blessed messengers are directing each step with cherish and care. This individual knows that there is no turning back. The want they feel for you is not something short-lived. It is not a fire that will quench over time. On the opposite, each day this feeling reinforces and grows, taking over each thought, each feeling. They feel that what you share is something one of a kind. Association that rises above the standard and touches the profundities of the soul. The blessed messengers uncover that this individual is encountering a blend of seriously feelings. There is energy in at last uncovering what they feel, but there is too a fear that goes with this disclosure. They know they are almost to uncover themselves in a way they never have some time recently, and this brings up profound vulnerabilities. Be that as it may, the want to be by your side, to live this truth with you, is more grounded than any fear. Dear soul, the blessed messengers need you to know that this individual sees you as somebody fundamental in their life. They have realized all through this travel that everything they have lived until presently as arranged though for this minute. All the fears, waverings, and challenges they faced, all of this was essential for them to at last hit at the profundity of what they feel for you. And presently they are prepared to take the most critical step, to open their heart and permit this door to completely blossom. The blessed messengers appear that this disclosure will be a minute of incredible freedom for both you and this individual. It will be as if an undetectable obstruction is being broken down, permitting both of you to see the truth with that up to clarity. You will at last be able to see at each other without the veils that fear made and realize that a door has continuously been there, holding up for the right minute to manifest. This individual, who for so long attempted to stand up to what they felt, has presently surrendered to the control of this cherish, they get it that you are the lost piece, the component that brings a just and meaning to their life. And the blessed messengers need you to know that this feeling is veritable, profound, and genuine. They are prepared to live this truth with you without reservations, without fear, and without barriers. Dear one, if my message has filled your heart with joy and hope, let it be known. Press the like button as a sign of your embrace of my love. Dear soul, the blessed messengers inquire that you welcome this individual with a door and sympathy. They are almost to open up in a way that requires a part of metal, and your reaction will be significant for this modern starting. This is the minute to appear that you are too prepared to live this truth, to appear that the door between you is solid sufficient to overcome any challenge the past may have brought. The universe organized each detail of this assembly. Everything you have lived until presently was portion of a bigger range, something that was ordained to happen, and presently this fate is uncovering itself some time recently your eyes. 
The individual who carries this wand for you is prepared to completely yield to live this cherish with all the escalated it deserves. Dear soul, the blessed messengers appear me that what is to come is a modern chapter in your life, a chapter filled with a door, development, and change. You both have the opportunity to construct something extraordinary together, something that rises above time and circumstances, and the blessed messengers will be by your side, directing each step, guaranteeing that this cherish blooms in the most wonderful and genuine way possible. This individual, who faltered so numerous times and addressed themselves so numerous times, is presently prepared to tell the truth. They are burning with crave for you, and the universe has arranged the way for you to live this truth together. Everything that remained in question is disseminating, and a door is around to sparkle in all its intensity. Dear soul, the blessed messengers need you to know that you are meriting of this cherish. Everything you went through, all the troubles and instabilities, brought you to this minute. Presently it is time to permit a door to stream openly, to open your heart to this modern stage, and believe that the universe is directing everything to the best conceivable outcome. My cherished child, come closer and let us grasp a serene minute together. Take a profound breath and delay to appreciate all the favors you have nowadays, your valuable life, the adore of your family and companions, your great well-being, the new disgust you breathe in, the feeding nourishment some time recently you, the secure sanctuary of your domestic, my faithful assurance over your staying, and the blessed messengers relegated to protect your rest and observe over you. Incalculable reasons encompass you to feel really favored, with day-by-day -day updates to treasure each minute. Reflect on these endowments to sustain positive considerations and stay mindful of my nearness in your life, trusting that I hold your future securely. I stay in the heart that gives much obliged and recognizes its require for me, one that looks for me with confidence and trust, completely understanding its endowments. Now and then I see you vexed by the occasions unfurling around you, and that is characteristic. Do not let stress overpower you, you bear the weight of your obligations since you crave well-being for everything around you, your domestic to be given for, your family to stay solid, and your peace and solidness to remain in taglio. However, there are dim times when appreciation slits absent, and the adversary whispers questions, planting beguiling considerations that turn your concern into fear, encompassing you with lies and changing fear into anguish and despair. I am here, observing and holding up for you to lift your arms and talk the words that will drive the foe absent. Provide much appreciated for your life, your family, your well-being, for all that you are and all that you have. Your earnest confidence and thankful heart act as shields that secure and enable you. As a modern day starts, I enthusiastically anticipate you to begin with expressions of appreciation. Thank you from the profundities of your heart. Thank you for life itself. If you're in a rush, take a minute to tune into these words briefly. But if you can, delay and grasp this message filled with bliss and comfort. I cheer in you, for you have touched my substance and blended my soul. In spite of the challenges in your way, your confidence in me remains solid. Since of your faithfulness, I guarantee that indeed more endowments will flow, not fair for you, but too for those you cherish. Do not vacillate, do not lose heart. Keep moving forward without fear. Reach out to the sky, indeed when you feel fatigued. Take time to sit with me, to conversation, to share your considerations, your dreams, your most profound feelings. Child, as I have filled you with hope and peace, so must you be a vessel of my love. Share this with three souls who hunger for inspiration, and let my spirit touch their lives through you. Remember, life is maintained not fair by bread, but by each word that comes from my position of authority. My dear child, at this exceptionally minute, I have laid out a devour for you, a dinner luxuriously arranged to favor you inexhaustibly. It floods with food, support, 
tranquility, and consolation. I offer you my peace, a blessing that I openly donate. Get profoundly into your heart. When the burdens of this world develop overwhelming, let the tender gleam of my cherish remind you that I am ever present, always by your side. Focus not as it were on your hands, which may tire, nor let your soul depend exclusively on the fondness and endorsement of others. Whereas I outline you to both grant and get a door, know that the as it were a door that is interminable and unchanging, the adore that you will have forever, is my delicate adore for you. It never falters, is continuously close, and is absolutely secure. Protect your heart from those who might take off you, and do not stick your trusts on those who, after taking all, might halt cherishing you. Dodge putting at the center of your life those who might deceive you, wound your heart, or disturb your peace. You have looked for trust, and here it is legitimately yours. Continuously remind yourself that you are never alone, never surrendered. Indeed, if your closest ones, your guardians, family, or children, should turn absent or take off you, the most significant and persevering love is continuously accessible to you. My adore is your wonderful father, who profoundly cherishes you. I know you require to listen these words. I am here to offer assistance you overcome your challenges, to rise over disheartening, and to proceed on your travel without losing confidence, empowering you to prosper and thrive. Believe in me, for I am your wonderful father. Feel free to conversation with me, to share your needs, for I wish for you to see and know me as a near companion. I am prepared to expand my hand to you, continuously mindful and prepared to listen. Speaking with me brings consolation to your heart, calms your soul, and ushers peace into your intellect. When you voice your feelings in your claim words, your confidence is aroused, and supernatural occurrences start to unfurl. Nowadays is your opportunity to express all that is on your heart, but moreover to tune in as I talk to you. Know this, I am not here to judge, condemn, or describe your past disappointments. Tune in closely to the delicate whisper of my soul. I am asserting my cherish for you, energetically holding up for you to recognize me each morning, recognizing your require, and cherish for me. As you stir, your sincere expressions are your worship, your law that rises to my position of authority at the dawns to begin with light. My nearness attacks your life, your family, and your domestic with cherish and assurance. My dear child, continuously keep in mind, when challenges emerge, I am here to help you. There's no require for stress. I will give the great things you look for if they are to favor your life. I will reply quickly and with all my door. Keep in mind, no one in this world can offer the peace and cherish that I give. I have gave upon you confidence, quality, boldness, and tirelessness. These endowments will engage you to overcome any boundary and triumph in each fight. You accept in and serve a God who is lively, forceful, and works past the obvious. Lock in with me, sense my nearness, and believe in my power. Rise presently. Grasp life with abundance. Utilize the words you listen from me nowadays. Tell me how much a door you require, for my heart is brimming with cherish for you, and nowadays I am arranged to soak you with a cherish that is kind sweet, strengthening, understanding, sympathetic, and eternal. The issue that weighs on your intellect is safely in my care. Put your full belief in me. Lay your way some time recently me each day. Keep up your confidence and I will lead you. When you stir, you will feel revitalized with a strong sense of confidence lighting up inside you. This sensation is my blessing to you, elevating your soul and giving a compelling reason to rise each morning. Approach the day with excitement. Handle your assignments with assurance, produce modern connections, and grasp the openings I lay some time recently you. I delight in your joy when you get my endowments, 
and I cherish your expressions of gratitude. Even those went with by tears. Permit yourself to feel that significant delight. I am filling you with such joy that it eclipses any past pity. Your time of consolation is near, the answers to your supplications are prospective, and I am prepared to offer upon you the finest favors that will feed your soul and guarantee nothing can separate your association to my love. Cease your singular battles, as it were leads to depletion. Take a minute in step to near your eyes and endow me with your concerns. Lay down your burdens at my feet. You will not confront, overcome, or mortification. I am here to help you with your needs. Fair secure your heart and ignore those who wish for your ruin. Stand up to despair's infringement in your heart. Direct clear of those who would or maybe see you pitiful or who announce you unworthy. For in my eyes, you are priceless. Your confidence in me reflects your understanding of how profoundly I esteem and cherish you. Precious child, if you seek to know me more, click join. Together, we will journey through deeper truths with the support of a community built on my love. I am here to reaffirm the endlessness of my cherish and to share the superb plans I have for you. I know you feel my nearness emphatically nowadays, and this feeling will escalating with each passing day. You will overcome your challenges, discover freedom, and get favors. I will recuperate your wounds, diminish your physical torments, and alleviate the trouble that inconveniences you. I will permeate you with divine bliss and joy, dry your tears, and bring a brilliant grin back to your confront. You will raise your voice in tune to broadcast your adore for me. Those who wish sick upon you will witness that you are cherished and defended by me. You will have certainty of my reality, and in spite of the fact that a few may question and deny my presence, you will stand enduring in the favored put I have set for you. Your establishment will be unwavering. No one will unstick you from your position. Today, I give upon you bliss and imbue you with quality, reigniting your get up and go for life and your enthusiasm to offer assistance and serve others. Grasp this chance to live a wealthy, full life. Assimilate the positive messages I send you and develop in intelligence and cherish each day. You no longer require to endure or rebuke yourself for past mistakes. Open your heart to my absolution, knowing that my nearness will be with you at all times, prepared to help and react at whatever point you reach out to me in supplication. You require not utilize amazing words to talk to me. I get at the dialect of your heart. When you whisper, offer assistance me, I am there. When you call out, I require you, I reach out my hand. When tears drop and you say, I cannot go on, I will quickly come to you, grasp you, and in the stillness of your fatigued soul, I will delicately console you of my significant love. You have coordinate get to my position of royalty, approach with certainty to talk about your needs. I am continuously happy to tune in, enthusiastic to react so that you feel secure in any circumstance. Do not let fear take hold. You are never doing combat and alone. I am prepared to help you in everything, always accessible to tune in. Endeavor in your life, for it is the valuable blessing I have given you. Commit time to your cherished ones, giving them with the care and consideration they require. Stay constant in your work, control clear of inconsequential debate, and dismiss hurtful considerations. Walk through life with delight, raise your hands in laud beneath the open sky and express appreciation for your existence. I am your genuine, sacred, and extraordinary cure for all trouble. In my hands, I hold your cherished ones and your future. Bear this in intellect and never lose trust. I will never spurn you. In paradise, favors flourish, each extraordinarily checked with your title. I am completely mindful of the plans I have for you, so believe in me with your entirety heart. Over the universe, components are adjusting, moving circumstances in your favor with outright certainty. I announce that you will get inexhaustible arrangements, flexibility from obligations, 
brilliant intelligence, and gifts particularly custom-made for you and your family. The divine legacy that is legitimately yours is no coincidence. I cared for you indeed some time recently you came into being, organizing endless superb things along your travel, the most noteworthy of which is my eternal cherish. I cherished you indeed when you were far off, and my ador remained enduring when you returned to my arms. Understand this, your slips do not incite my outrage, nor do they thrust me absent. If you accept something else, you are mixed up. Your botches do not dishearten me. I will not dismiss you since of your deficiencies. Each time you come back to me filled with honest-to-goodness atonement, I see your cherish for me. In your minutes of question, I see the truth in your heart and your eagerly. I appreciate your straightforwardness, for no mystery can be concealed from me. While a few may put on veneers of flawlessness and sacredness, fast to judge those who vary in conviction or behavior, you are not one to cast stones or see yourself as over others. Your soul is tranquil, your way delicate, and your considerations are unadulterated. Indeed, in your falters, you rise with confirmation and confidence. Do not let others judge you. No one in this world has that authority. Maintain this loyal demeanor. Approach me every day with a humble heart, prepared to tune in and learn, and I will fill your life with gifts. I know fabric riches does not charm you, but are maybe the gifts and security for your family, which I guarantee to give copiously. I am playing you so that when openings emerge, you will step through with courage. Even presently, as you tune in, supernatural occurrences are unfurling in the concealed domain. Unused individuals are entering your life like never some time recently, and circumstances that appear challenging will, through your confidence and persistence, change into endowments, bringing peace to your domestic and food to your family. The most important an excellent blessing is as of now yours, my faithful love. Tell me you accept in me. Believe in me and discover rest in my grasp, for I am in control of your life. Fear not, for I am securing you and observing over you continuously. I am by your side each day. As you stir, I wish for you to sense my nearness each morning. Let nothing occupy you in these early hours. Come listen my words, tune into what my soul is saying to you. I guarantee you I have everything in hand, and it is pivotal that you believe me. Do not fear hardships, for with me by your side, no control on soil can hurt you. Numerous of the stresses burdening you presently will be settled faster than you expect. At the right time, the answers you look for will be uncovered. Get it that I am the designer of your travel, creating your story with accuracy and reason. The endowments you long for are on their way. I am opening the door through which your sincere supplications have climbed. Your confidence is being fortified. I am here to lift you, to lead you into an unused first light, a new starting where all will be made modern. Do not concern yourself with the judgments of others. Stand steadfast and explore your life with confidence and respect. Those corrupted by envy will continuously voice their intensity. But keep in mind, my viewpoint is what really checks. In my eyes, you are all inspiring, having a heart filled with virtue and sincerity. Imprint my words onto your soul, and when confronted with misfortune, discover asylum in my grasp. I have been with you through each challenge, mindful of each drop, each jump, each triumph, and each fight. Presently is your minute to rise, to lift your life to exceptional statures. Take off behind the ancient debate and grasp a modern time filled with triumph and re-establishment. This is the time when your reality shifts, when you commence an unused chapter. Let me lead you on a way plenteous with favors and understanding. I amplify to you my ador and peace to relieve your soul and intellect. Are you prepared to acknowledge it? I will open the sky to extravagant you with favors. 
engrave my lessons upon your heart so that your steps are immovable and guarantee you never stray from the adore that wraps you. I will exculpate your blunders. You are human, you may flounder, but I am a god of sympathy. I welcome your remorse, and indeed from the least profundities I will lift you. My precious child, stay close to my word, for in it you will find peace. Join this community and subscribe, so my voice can reach you and strengthen you each day. My endowments outperform any natural wealth. What I have in store for you is more important than all the world's treasures. If I pronounce that I will open the sky for you, grasp my guarantee with conviction and react with certainty, knowing I stand by my word. This is not unimportant. My cherish is obvious. The love I hold for you is clear and profound. Step exterior. Look at the sky, feel the breeze, and the warmth of the sun on your skin. These are my endowments to you, my expressions of cherish, asserting that I am ever display. I have looked after you multitudinous times, protecting you from enduring, and indeed the brink of passing. Amid times when you meandered in perplexity and mistake, you are colossally important to me, and I have relegated you an interesting reason to achieve. My crave is to illustrate my cherish and control through you, persistently filling you with my heavenly soul. You are on the cusp of a critical move in otherworldly mindfulness. Before long, you will see past outward appearances, understanding the genuine thought processes of those around you. I will give upon you ample shrewdness, hoisting your understanding past standard limits. You will have the capacity to significantly affect numerous lives and give help that mirrors my teachings. Let your deeds reflect my lessons. Let others see in your life the natural products of your confidence and the transformative effect of knowing me. Believe in my might, reach out to get a handle on the abundant endowments I offer. Be honest to goodness, my child. Grasp me with a heart that resounds with mine. Broadcast your cherish and believe in me, ceaselessly casting aside all your concerns and surrendering completely to my care. I will lighten your fears and stresses, encompassing you in my adore and disclosing the wonders that my control can perform in your life. Today will be momentous. You will watch a change in your environment. You will witness changes in different viewpoints of your life, your family, and in the demeanors of those around you. You will see grins developing on faces as they feel my strong nearness in you. They will recognize me, and you will share their ponder as you approach them with support and happiness. Today, I bless you with boundless shrewdness and a significant availability to fulfill the wants of your heart. I recognize your profound longing for delight, and hence I energize you to believe in my decree. I'm adjusted to your sentiments and each circumstance in your life, protecting you from hurt, reinforcing your character, defending your respect, and giving you with quality, ensuring you from shame. Adjust your viewpoint, wear a grin with certainty. Look for me every day. Permit your tears to stream if required, and believe that I am here to back you in each viewpoint. Enchant in the adore I pour out on you. As you laud, and adore in my nearness, my soul will encompass you, facilitating your burdens and ingrains you with peace. Be blissful indeed in the midst of challenges, grin and sing. Offer acclaims and supplications, raise your hands in tribute, and when others ask all of your delight, announce that it is since God is with you. Even if a few may not get it, do not let the shake your peace. My effective powers are with you in each challenge. When you raise your hands and yield and commit to my reason, I will free you from all burdens, empowering you to believe completely in my elegance. You long for a altar, and I am here to revive your soul. Before long, you will witness how I wrap you in my adore. Move forward with confidence, casting aside any doubts. Seek me at the break of day, and fair as the morning sun surges the world with light, so as well will my wonderfulness light up your way, bringing brightness to your life. Taziness will have no hold on you, 
your heart will brim with my truth, your soul will pick up unused quality, and your intellect will be discharged from despair. My beloved, if this message has stirred your spirit and brought peace to your heart, let your action be a reflection of your love. Show your support and touch a like button. I empower you to re-establish your commitment to supplication, to look for me genuinely, to dispose of diversions, and to put your contemplations and choices beneath my care. In the midst of genuine challenges and deep-seated tensions, in minutes filled with vulnerability, I confirm your heading and call you to walk by confidence, for all things are conceivable for those who accept in me, who recognize my nearness and believe profoundly in me, indeed in the midst of hurdles. Those who get it and encounter my adore, who hold quick to me indeed in trials and in the midst of voices of question, keep in mind this, my adore for you is unending and immovable. I have continuously been by your side, continuously looked after you. Hold on to confidence, my dear child. I point to smooth your way and guarantee your security, but you must have genuine confidence in me. I am your life, your future, your quality, your shield. Proceed with affirmation, knowing that the supernatural occurrences you cannot however see will show. Indeed, if your confidence appears little, it is adequate. It will open the gifts that will keep streaming. Review what I have guaranteed you. Devote time each day to listen my voice. Let go of past blunders. Commit your life to me, for I know you have confidence in me. This confidence will support you consistently on your travel, and at that point suddenly, delight will spring forward in your heart, and your soul will be caught off watch by bliss. The dreams you thought had blurred will reignite, and the trust you set aside in darker times will rise once more. Your life will be imbued once again with confidence. You considered surrendering, feeling as in spite of the fact that you needed the quality to endure. Your challenges lingered huge, and life appeared terrible. However, nowadays, I am here close to you, amplifying my cherish and offering upon you brilliant endowments, delight, and numerous blessings. Prepare your intellect and heart, for I guarantee you that those you accepted had depleted from your life will come back. Your confidence has developed, and presently it is time to help those in trouble. Be arranged for when entryways swing open and obstructions drop absent. The impediments that once prevented your endowments will collapse. This is inside reach for those who accept in my guarantees and know that I am competent of all things. My dear child, prepared yourself, for what lies ahead outperforms indeed your most stupendous dreams. You will witness rebuilding and recuperating in your family connections, where pardoning and compromise thrive. Grasp these warmly. I guarantee not as it were to secure a way better position for you, but genuine victory. I will present individuals into your life who will recognize your esteem and compensate your perseverance and talents. Remain honest. Maintain a strategic distance from misdirection and talking contrary approximately others. Direct clear of locks in and talk or lies. Be attentive of those who might seize what is legitimately yours. I have been driving you for a few time, and presently is the minute to rise to unused level, to extend your comprehension of my lessons, and to put in me faithful belief. Do not depend exclusively on fabric riches, nor gotten to be upset if you confront misfortune of belonging or employment. I have more fantastic dreams for you. Believe in me wholeheartedly and give up your tensions to me, for it is time to enter an extraordinary chapter of your presence. Broadcast your cherish and confidence in me, and nowadays watch how my adore and might significantly affect your life and your family. My cherished child, Prioritize living in my nearness over all else. As you develop your relationship with me, you will discover that your mindfulness of my presence develops more grounded than your mindfulness of the individuals and places that encompass you. This significant association with me does not decrease your connections with others, or maybe it upgrades them in ways you never thought conceivable. When you center your life around me, 
your capacity to adore and energize those around you will prosper, actually stemming from the peace and delight that I offer upon you. Grasping my nearness will imbue your words and activities with my peace. You will talk with thoughtfulness, act with kindness, and move through life with a quiet certainty that others will take note and be motivated by. My peace will gotten to be apparent in your deportment, making you a guide of trust and cherish in a world that frequently feels chaotic and uncertain. People will be drawn to your calm and delicate soul, looking for the consolation and support you easily give. As you ended up more adjusted to me, you will discover yourself effectively taking part in the world, however keeping up a solid remove from its turmoil. You will lock in insignificant exercises, contribute emphatically to your community, and seek after your interests with unflinching commitment. Be that as it may, your establishment will stay solidly established in my nearness, permitting you to explore life's challenges with strength and beauty. My encompassing nearness acts as a shield, patting you from the blows of unforeseen issues and facilitating the burdens that life may put upon you. This divine way I have set some time recently you is one of inexhaustible life and peace. As you take after it wholeheartedly, each step you take will lead you closer to the fulfillment of your genuine reason. You will involve a lavishness in life that outperforms fabric riches or short-lived delights, finding genuine satisfaction in the relationship we share. My direction will light up your way, guaranteeing that each choice you make adjusts with my will and brings you closer to the inexhaustible life I have guaranteed you. Living in my nearness implies prioritizing our relationship over all else. Set aside diversions and commit time each day to interface with me through supplication, reflection, and reflection on my word. As you develop this insinuate relationship, you will discover that your needs move and your center gets to be centered on what really things. This move will engage you to let go of stresses and tensions, supplanting them with belief and certainty in my arrange for your life. Your developing mindfulness of me will extend your understanding of my adore and reason for you. You will start to see the world through my eyes, recognizing the magnificence and potential in each circumstance. This divine point of view will change the way you associate with others, cultivating more profound associations and more important connections. Your capacity to empathize, back, and elevate those around you will gotten to be a confirmation to the transformative control of living in my nearness. As you proceed to prioritize our relationship, you will take note a note with the altar in how you handle challenges. Instead of feeling overpowered or crushed, you will approach impediments with a sense of calm and confirmation, knowing that I am by your side. My dear child, I ask of you to join in this mission of spreading my truth and love. By contributing through Buy Me A Coffee, you become part of a greater purpose, sharing my word with many. Your offering is treasured, and I thank you with all my heart. My peace will penetrate each viewpoint of your life, giving you with the quality and boldness to confront anything comes your way. You will end it up a column of steadiness and trust for others, representing the faithful confidence that supports you. My nearness will moreover upgrade your otherworldly affectability, permitting you to see the inconspicuous developments of the soul in your life and the lives of those around you. You will end it up more adjusted to my direction, accepting divine bits of knowledge and motivations that will lead you toward satisfying your God-given purpose. This increased mindfulness will empower you to observe openings for development, benefit, and service, enabling you to make an enduring effect in your community and past. In your everyday intelligent, my peace will sparkle through you, making you a source of consolation and support for others. Whether you are sharing a kind word, advertising or making a difference and or essentially being display for somebody in require, your activities will reflect my adore and elegance. Individuals will be drawn to your honest to goodness kindness and unflinching back, finding comfort and quality in your nearness. Your life will gotten to be a living declaration of my peace, rousing others to look for the same divine connection. 
as you explore the complexities of life. Keep in mind that my nearness is your steady companion. You are never alone, and you never have to confront your battles without my back. Incline on me in times of instability and let my peace direct you through the storms of life. Believe in my timing and my arrange, knowing that I am working all things together for your great. My adore and peace are continuously accessible to you, giving the establishment you require to flourish in each season of life. Embrace the travel of living in my nearness with an open heart and a willing soul. Permit my peace to fill each corner of your being, changing your considerations, feelings and activities. As you submerge yourself in my adore, you will find a more profound sense of reason and fulfillment, finding delight in each minute and quality in each challenge. This is the life I have arranged for you, one of plenitude, peace and interminable cherish. Remain committed to this way and observe as my endowments unfurl in ways you never envisioned. Your life will button to be a confirmation to my steadfastness, a signal of light that draws others to look for the same divine connection. Let my peace be the establishment upon which you construct your life, and let my cherish direct you in each choice and each step you take. Together, we will walk this way encountering the completion of life and peace that as it were I can give. Keep in mind, my child, that you are cherished and esteemed past degree. My nearness is a blessing that maintains you, engages you, and fills you with perpetual trust and delight. Live each day in my nearness and let my peace rule in your heart and intellect, directing you toward a life of genuine wealth and eternal happiness. I cherish you, my child and I am enthusiastic to enter your domestic to perform a significant wonder. I stand at your entryway, calling out to you. Will you let me in, permitting me to bring something modern, brilliant, effective and powerful into your life? I am mindful of your challenges, and I guarantee that shortage will not touch your family or torment your family. I am prepared to splash your domestic with and wealth of blessings, you have been reliable for numerous a long time, imploring heightening, fasting, shedding tears, and prioritizing me in your contemplations and deeds. The time is drawing near for you to collect the rewards of your immovable dedication. I will fill your domestic with thriving, joy, vitality, and well-being. Believe in my guarantees, for I am committed to satisfying them. Plan for a critical change breaking absent from the shackles of past stresses and discouragement. With my favors, I too give you shrewdness, quality, and the acumen to make judicious choices, securing the blessings you've gotten and guaranteeing they increase for the great of others. Remain thankful and believe in my transformative control. I am getting you prepared for a period when various openings will come your way. Your confidence, developed over time, will abdicate a wealthy collect. In spite of confronting extreme challenges, you never misplaced confidence in my power, and as a result, you stand triumphant. Your confidence is important, your lowliness, splendid. These qualities will carry you far. Get prepared, for I am approximately to open modern entryways for you, driving to unexplored domains and bringing success to your family. Be guaranteed, you are never alone. Recently, you cried over sudden hardships and double crossings, feeling left by those you trusted. In any case, know this, I have seen your tears climb to the sky, coming to my divine position of royalty, where your destiny is molded, where your afflictions are cured, and where your inconveniences are resolved. I offer you comfort in your trouble. You are not deserted, Indeed, if those you depended upon have turned their backs, I stay unswervingly at your side, cherishing you more with each passing day. Believe that I am here to tune in, and through the beauty I amplify, you have prompt get to my divine nearness. Come to me and share the most profound wants of your heart. I am persistent and adoring, continuously a reliable friend. 
I empower you not to hold back your tears, for they are not shed in unsuccessful. Unburden your soul, and let me supplant your largeness with my peace. Keep in mind, bliss takes after distress, and your bliss will be significant. This is the minute for your favors to unfurl. You are arranged to get the endowments I have in store for you. The challenges you've persevered have prepared you for a season of bounty. The sky are balanced to open, showering endless endowments upon you. Indeed, in the still minutes, feel my recuperating and comforting nearness, knowing you are never isolated. Your heart will brim with bliss, and I will divulge the entryways to marvelous gifts. Be that as it may, notice my words to the conclusion. Cast aside any questions, for your immovability will before long surrender wealthy rewards. I see the way you've strolled and get it the eagerly of your heart. You do not chase after brief riches, but look for arrangement to elevate your family, settle your obligations, and help others. I am prepared to give these gifts upon you. It is my crave that the entryways of paradise will swing wide, deluging you with genuine gifts until your life overflows. Believe in me and I will act. Stand up with resolve and proceed your endeavors. Take rest as required, but rise over again each day. Thrust forward with metal and all the energy your soul can gather. Development without grievances or laments, with essentialness and bliss. Indeed, if not all unfurls as you trust, or if there are those who point to disturb your peace, hold on in agreement with our range. In those testing times, keep up enduring soul, standing firm against your challenges, advertising foes a grin, appearing persistence, giving water to the parched, and loaning a hand to those who stumble. Act with shrewdness, utilizing the judgment skills you've been invested with. Be cautious in sharing individual subtle elements or vulnerabilities that might be utilized against you. Show cherish, but to the genuine character fashion through your life encounters. Secure yourself from those who might abuse your qualities and dodge taking part in talk. Your foes will develop frantic when they see that they cannot block your progress. My dear one, the blessings I pour into your heart are meant to be shared. Give this message of hope to three who are in need, and let them feel my love through your kindness. I will evacuate such deterrence from your way. Our travel together propels. Proceed moving forward with confidence, vigor, and commitment until I direct you something else. In time, you will pick up a more profound understanding. You will experience a noteworthy opportunity, an entryway driving to monstrous favors. Assert presently your conviction in this guarantee that entering every day into my nearness and setting out on this range is commendable. My courageous child, I cherish your confidence, for you are implied to triumph over your challenges. Your concerns are as of now settled by me. It is superior for you to yield all your stresses, fears, and despondency to me. My sacred soul wraps you giving recuperating and comfort inside you. Sparkles of crave will touch off to live, to rise, to battle, and to prevail. I am producing unused ways for you, but it is crucial that you recognize your worth and give yourself another opportunity. Acknowledge my elegance and my pardoning. Let go of any blame from past slips, knowing your apology is honest to goodness and sincere. I bear no hatred for your past mistakes and will not keep returning to them. Your past botches are wiped from your record. I expel all unnecessary enduring. With me, you are freed and mended. You will get the direction vital and the quality to go up against any challenge or adversary. Notice your folk and reduce the delight I have set aside for you. Believe in this. Indeed, if it's not however obvious or unmistakable, when these favors arrive, it will be a day of colossal bliss. You will encounter a level of joy phenomenal in your life. From this minute forward, I will bless you with sacred oil, and my divine control will progressively show in you. Your vitality will develop, 
your intellect will be revived, and you will get a handle on my guarantees more completely. The heading and reason of your life will clarify, and you will perceive the way you must walk to fulfill your fate. I confirm that you have as of now explored through your most challenging a long time. Ahead lies a season of wealth, a time to procure various endowments and to fill your saves to flooding. In times past, you persevered hardships, and you separated with despondency from those who cleared out your side. There were minutes when you felt as in spite of the fact that the conclusion was close, but nowadays you stand in triumph. Nothing in your future will be able to take absent your endowments. Your confidence is presently more grounded than ever. You have retained my lessons and have come to know me profoundly. You presently get a handle of the endowments that are arranged for you and your family. Each part of your family is noteworthy and included in my plan. I energize you to be gutsy and immovable, reminding everybody in your domestic that these endowments are not coincidental. They are the rewards of your confidence, your dedication, your sincere atonement, and your unfaltering choice to turn absent from wrongdoing. My cherished child, I guarantee you that you will not return to your ancient ways. The way ahead is filled with modern beginnings and trust. A few individuals of your family may go through changes, they essentially require to look for me a bit more genuinely. When they come to me with open hearts, vowing in lowliness, I will donate them the capacity to genuinely know me, not fair from what others say, but in a genuine and substantial way, in soul and in truth. There are those in your family who confront critical choices. They require to recognize their botches and separate themselves from impacts that lead them off track. I will provide you plenteous cherish and persistence to delicately share with them what I have instructed you, talking with benevolence and sympathy. Do not take on the part of their judge. I have sent you to be a reference point of trust for them, not to rebuff or turn them absent. If you really cherish me and believe in me, keep in mind this vital truth. Everybody has the capacity to alter. I offer unused life to all who earnestly atone and look for me. Open your heart and see the opportunity to care for your adored ones. Supplicate for them intensely and believe that I am at work in their lives, indeed when you cannot see it. When the minute comes for you to portion ways with a few, do so with thoughtfulness and beauty. Permit me to work inside their hearts. I guarantee you I will not fall flight you. As you walk this travel, I will uncover experiences to you, sometimes through dreams and tender whispers to your spirit, especially concerning your family. You will reconnect with individuals you haven't seen in numerous a long time. When you eat them, welcome them with warmth and honest to goodness grin. Amplify your hand in fellowship and share the message of my adore. Tell them that I care profoundly for them, that I crave to re-establish their spirits and bring them peace. Let them know that I am mindful of their internal battles and the exhaustion they carry. Energize them to open their hearts to me, to recognize their botches and to reach out to me in supplication, wherever they are, even if it's fair a straightforward sincere supplication. Favor them by talking words of trust and bliss into their lives. Plant in their hearts a seed of confidence that can develop into a solid and persevering tree. Follow my direction, believe in me totally, and grasp a life filled with confidence and reason. Your stresses and fears have as of now been tended to. Take off them in my hands. Rasp each day with peace in your heart, for exceptional ponders are almost to unfurl in your life. You will discover yourself lifting your hands in bliss, lauding in my heavenly title. The challenges that once appeared overpowering will blur absent, and you will witness my control at work in ways you never envisioned. Keep in mind, I am continuously with you, directing your steps and lighting your way. When questions crawl in, turn to me, and I will reinforce your confidence. Do not be debilitated by difficulties or delays. Each minute is portion of a more prominent arrange that I have for you. Arrange to succeed you and not to hurt you, to provide you trust and a future. 
Take time to inundate yourself in my word, for it is a light to your feet and a light to your way. Let feed your soul and recharge your intellect. Share its shrewdness with those around you so they as well may discover consolation and course. In your minutes of calm reflection, tune in for my voice. I may talk to you through the magnificence of creation, through the thoughtfulness of a stranger, or through the still little voice inside your heart. Be mindful, for I am communicating with you in numerous ways. Do not belittle the control of supplication. It is your coordinate line to me, a way to share your most profound considerations, fears, and wants. When you implore, know that I listen you, and I am as of now working on your behalf. Child of mine, if these words have spoken to your soul and brought light to your day, let your response be an offering of gratitude by tapping the like button. As you associated with your family and companions, appear them on restricted love, the same Mador that I have appeared you. Be quiet and excusing, fair as I am understanding and excusing with you. Your case will talk volumes, and through your activities, they will see my door reflected. A few may stand up to or turn absent it to begin with, but do not lose heart. Seeds planted nowadays may take time to develop. Believe that in due season, they will grow and bear natural product. Proceed to be a source of support and bolster. Grasp the openings I put some time recently you to serve others. Acts of benevolence and liberality not as it were favor those you offer assistance, but moreover bring delight to your claim heart. In serving others, you are serving me. Know that your travel will not continuously be simple, but you are never alone. I am by your side through each trial and triumph. When you feel frail, incline on me and I will deliver you quality. When you are blissful, share that delight with others so it may multiply. Keep your eyes settled on the way I have laid out for you. Maintain a strategic distance from diversions that lead you, absent from your reason. Remain grounded in confidence, and let trust be your grapple. I have awesome things in store for you. Blessings past degree. Believe in my timing, for I know what is best for you. Be persistent, and stay steadfast as you move forward. Keep in mind to express appreciation for the gifts you have as of now gotten. Appreciative heart opens the entryway to indeed more of my goodness. Let your life be a confirmation to my cherish. Cherish and beauty through you will permit others to come to know me and involvement the bliss of a relationship with me. Take consolation in knowing that your supplications are effective and viable. They can move mountains and alter hearts. Proceed to implore for those you adore and observe as change unfurls. Let go of tensions and fears, for I am in control. Believe that I am working all things together for your great. Lift your hands in a door, sing acclaims to my title, and let your soul celebrate, for I am the ruler your God, and I charm in you. Grasp this day and the days to come with certainty and delight. Uncommon ponders are not fair ahead, they are stardew presently. Accept in my guarantees and you will see them satisfied in your life. I cherish you with an eternal adore. Go forward in peace and know that I am continuously with you. I am here to secure you from the traps set to victimize you of the great future I have arranged for you. There will be those who attempt to burden you with disappointments that aren't yours, with imperfections you do not recognize, and with sins they've invoked up. Dismiss these misrepresentations, for they occupy you from the superb life you may be living with me. Halt underestimating yourself and feeling blameworthy over things I have as of now excused. I'm a god of benevolence, adore, and absolution. Your apology is earnest, and through my give up, you have been cleansed. Take off the past behind and do not torment yourself with it. Never let anybody make you feel inconsequential. Keep in mind, I have never cleared out your side, nor will I ever forsake you. My cherish for you is boundless. 
Edit that I gave my all for you. I yielded myself so that you might walk with nobility. The conclusions of others do not characterize you. What genuinely characterizes you is my announcement. You are my child. My winner. Do not be hindered by those voices that judge you cruelly at each turn. You were not made to rub by, looking for transitory minutes of bliss, but to overcome challenges and seize triumphs. Know that I cherish you profoundly, and you are valuable to me. I am not here to admonish you, nor am I balanced to rebuff you at each misstep. Those who think I look for to incur discipline are deluded by lies. Believe in me, for I completely get a handle on your anguish and distress. Bring your pain to me and get it that I am continuously adjacent to you, enthusiastic to saturate your soul with words that will support your confidence. Your tears will be changed into bliss, and the time for your endowments is drawing closer. With unceasing affection, I have cherished you without limits, and my kindness will until the end of time go with you. Let us begin, O oh, my charity child. Each day is a profitable chance to press ahead. Cast aside your burdens, your disheartening, and your grievances. Clear your intellect of yesterday's inconveniences. There's no require to carry weights that avoid the onset of your otherworldly re-establishment. Grasp each modern day with trust and boldness, for in my adore, you have the quality to confront anything. Talk merciful to yourself. Do not gotten to be or possess most exceedingly bad adversary on the war zone of your intellect. Stand up to the lies that propose altar is unattainable or that your future is destined to reflect a past defaced by sadness and despair. Trust in the centrality of my travel to the cross. The serious enduring I persevered was deliberate, not futile. Indeed, as numerous companions left me, feeling disfavored, I was completely mindful from the starting of time that you as well would experience trials and dismissal. However, I have guaranteed you a remunerate past measure, an interminable crown, and a life filled with wealth. These wonders anticipate you, but you must have confidence in my words to encounter a genuine change of the intellect. Do not let negative contemplations overcome you. At whatever point you feel overpower and near to giving up, keep in mind that I am your source of essentialness. Permit me the opportunity to change you so significantly that others may barely recognize you. Where once there was distress, bliss will take root. Where lose hope once stayed, you will find a recently discovered enthusiasm for life, adore, and absolution in abundance. I excused your transgressions long back. Nowadays, I expand a new welcome for you to start over again. Here I am once more, grasping you and advertising a door that resuscitates your soul and changes your viewpoint. Get it that my cherish for you is tireless and boundless. Reflect on this truth and hold it near in my sacrosanct heart. My cherish for you is boundless, my devotion is immovable, my benevolence is unending, and my elegance is boundless. When you blunder, I react not with outrage but with persistence, giving you space to recognize your botches. There's no require to cover up, escape, alter your personality, migrate, or imagine you do not know or listen me. I do not want to keep you. I come to tenderly thump on the entryway of your heart since my ador is enduring, and it will endure. Do not endeavor to comprehend my nature or draw parallels with people. Do not gauge your value of ador or fear dismissal based on your looks, insights, riches, destitution, past mistakes, or in deceptive standard of flawlessness. Be mindful of the scars cleared out by those who claim to cherish you however fizzled. Keep in mind, I am diverse. Each morning, as you begin your day, confirm with conviction, Jesus, I believe in you. I grasp your cherish, and in any case of what may come, I will proceed to believe in your persevering goodness and loyalty. My dear child, open your heart wide and get the boundless adore and inexhaustible endowments I am pouring out upon you nowadays. Submerge yourself in my word, examine it once again, 
for I am your shepherd who affectionately guides you through each season of life. My word is your compass, your source of intelligence, and the light that enlightens your way. When you dive into it, you will discover the answers you look for and the consolation your soul yearns for. Speak my guarantees out loud with certainty and delight. Let them resound in your domestic and reverberate in your heart. Type in them down and put them where your eyes can see them daily, on your entryways, your windows, your mirrors, so that each look reminds you of my unfailing adore and loyalty. My sacred word is lively and capable. It will work supernatural occurrences in your life, mending your most profound wounds and lifting the weight of disheartening from your shoulders. Imagine my cherish as a crystal clear waterway streaming perpetually through each room of your domestic, each corner of your heart. These streams of living water will cleanse you of all that burdens you. They will wash absent each botch, each disappointment, each harmed and disloyalty you've ever experienced. No longer will clashes and hard feelings hold you captive. Dear child, if this message has moved your spirit, express your faith and let others see my love through your actions. I will reinforce your body, re-establish your intellect, and free you from all shapes of persecution and uneasiness. Permit my heavenly word to soak your being, let it fill you with trust, peace, and a delight that outperforms all understanding. Each day, open your book of scriptures with desire and confidence. Let its truths feed your soul and direct your steps. Grasp the delicate and eternal adore I offer, a door that never blurs, never falls flat, and never closes. I have come to tell you by and by that I cherish you past degree and I talk these words direly since I know how much you require to listen them. You are never alone. Indeed, when you feel disconnected or overlooked, I am right there with you. Wherever you go, anything you confront, my nearness encompasses you. Speak to me. Utilize your possessed words to express your belief and confidence. Announce out loud that I am your God, your Father, your loyal companion. Let your voice confirm the truth that I am perpetual and ever-present in your life. I have made a special and uncommon reason fair for you, plans to thrive you and not to hurt you, to allow you trust and a future. I have come not to judge or condemn, but to spare and re-establish. Open your heart indeed more to me. Put your belief in my hands and do not lose trust, no matter the circumstances. You do not require to depend your life to those who care as it were for themselves, who do not esteem your worth or your future. Do not let the envy or pessimism of others debilitate your confidence or reduce our relationship. Keep your heart unadulterated and pardoning, discharge any feelings of resentment or intensity. Let go of past harms. Treat everybody with tolerance and adore, fair as I have cherished you. Permit me to mend the wounds of dismissal and to fill your heart with my unlimited love. If others have thought little of you or fizzled to see your genuine esteem, know that this is not a reflection of who you are. Do not feel second-rate or less than anybody else. Keep in mind, I have not rejected you. In reality, I have chosen you. You have invited me into your life, your family, and your soul. Absolution streams inside you. There is no condemnation on your lips, no perniciousness in your words. Stand firm in the put I have built up for you. You are tied down on the strong shake of your salvation, establishment that cannot be shaken. You are cleansed and secured from head to toe by the control of my give up. My door has washed over you, evacuating each recolor, each sin, your confidence, indeed in its straightforwardness, is valuable to me. It is not the greatness of your activities but the truthfulness of your heart that delights me. I cherish you profoundly, more than you can comprehend. Take consolation in this truth and let it saturate each portion of your life. Know that my cherish for you is immovable and perpetual. I want to walk with you day by day to share in your delights and to carry you through your distresses. 
Believe in me wholeheartedly and do not let fear or question take root in your heart. Grasp the unused beginnings I am advertising you. Each day is a new begin, a blessing of elegance and opportunity. Take off behind the burdens of the past, the botches, the disillusionments, the what uncertainties. They do not characterize you. In step, settle your eyes on the guarantees I have laid some time recently you. Let trust emerge inside you like the daybreak breaking through the night. Keep in mind that I am your steady companion. When you feel frail, I am your quality. When you are dubious, I am your direct. When you are disturbed, I am your peace. Do not waver to reach out to me in supplication, pour out your heart, for I am continuously tuning in. Indeed when words fall flight you, I get at the most profound growings of your soul. Encompass yourself with my word. Let it be the tune that relieves your soul and the truth that grapples your intellect. Ponder on it day and night. Permit its intelligence to coordinate your choices and its guarantees to fuel your confidence. As you draw closer to me, you will discover that your wants adjust more with mine and the way some time recently you gets to be clearer. Do not be influenced by the voices of the world that look for to divert or debilitate you. Stand firm against the tides of question and pessimism. Your character is found in me, not in the transitory suppositions of others. You are dreadfully and magnificently made, created with purposeful and cherish. Celebrate the special endowments and gifts I have set inside you. Reach out to others with the same cherish and beauty I have amplified to you. Be a light in the obscurity, a reference point of trust to those who are misplaced or harming. Share the consolation you have gotten, and in doing so, you will discover your possessed delight increased. Pardon those who have wronged you, not since they merit it, but since holding on to sharpness as it were hurts you. Discharge them into my hands, and you will discover opportunity and peace. Let cherish be your directing rule, the establishment upon which you construct all connections. Keep in mind that challenges and trials are openings for development. They refine your character and reinforce your confidence. Do not be crippled when challenges emerge. In step, see them as minutes where my control can be made culminate in your weakness. Take strength, my child, for I am with you continuously. I will never take off you nor spurn you. My cherish is an unbreakable pledge fixed by the give up I made for you. Rest in this affirmation and let it bring peace to your soul as you travel forward. Keep your eyes settled on me. Believe that I am working all things together for your great. Indeed when you cannot see the full picture. Know that I am coordinating each detail with culminate shrewdness. Let appreciation fill your heart in all circumstances. Grant much obliged, for this opens the door to more noteworthy favors. Appreciative heart recognizes my hand at work and welcomes more of my nearness into your life. Grasp the life I have given you with bliss and expectation. Awesome things are ahead, and I am energized to walk this way with you. Together, we will overcome deterrence, celebrate triumphs, and make a story of recovery and adore that will rouse others. You are my adored child, and I charm in you. Take these words to heart and let them change the way you see yourself and the world around you. Rest presently in my peace and let my cherish encompass you nowadays and continuously. Amen. Precious child, if my words have brought comfort and strength to your heart, express your love by tapping the like button in gratitude. My child, come near and listen my words on the favors of absolution. This act, which so changes the soul, exudes from the wellspring of divine cherish inside. Pardoning offers opportunity past degree, however opening its control requires profound strength and kindness. What is this blessing that shapes life's travel? Absolution rises above the wounds delivered callously or carelessly by others. It rises over the chaos of feeling to clear the inward sky. 
more than the revamping of broken bridges between souls, absolution reproduces the soul itself. Those who excuse are not lessened, showing shortcoming or yield, or maybe they stand tall as otherworldly warriors, heroes who conquer the evil spirits of intensity and fear. For in the conclusion, it is hatred that detains the harmed heart as unquestionably as any prison holds captive the indicted felon. You may inquire, what is this pardoning, this get-out-of-jail-free card for sins against me? No, essentially this absolution is the most elevated expression of a door in activity. It blessings the guilty party opportunity from condemnation and frees you from playing jury and judge over others' transgressions. Pardoning does not absolve destructive deeds or eradicate bad form from history's slate nor is compromise with the transgressor required for its recuperating speculative chemistry to light. Pardoning streams from the choice to permit my divine elegance to change torment into intelligence, contempt into compassion. Why ought to you, the injured one, be the conveyor of this blessing? Why not request equity, reprisal for the blows that thumped you to your knees? Have I not said that I might reimburse in due time all human deeds, favoring the kind and reviling the brutal. However, adored, take care that in condemning other sins, you do not tie yourself in chains of hatred and self-poisoning considerations. The rutted shards of recollections that cut most profound frequently reflect back the contempt around inside the harmed heart. I made you for so much more than this. Hence, come, adored child, take my hand and walk the street less traveled with me. On this way, we take off, behind the overwhelming stuff of hard feelings born quietly for so long. I get it you may not feel prepared to excuse grave treacheries and profound infringement of belief, but I tell you presently, flexibility is standing by round the another twist for those courageous sufficient to discharge sharpness. In your darkest hour, when waves of outrage or lose hope whip brutally, cling quick to me. Permit my divine elegance to implant you with untold quality and courage. The revival control. The control to restore trust. Trust cleared out for dead. To raise magnificence from fiery debris. It rests torpid inside you this exceptionally minute. Stir presently and call it forward by naming your most profound wounds in this fortune some time recently me at the position of authority of beauty. Permit my light to bathe you in warmth and my living waters to cleanse you as I expel disgrace and stun from your intellect. May you see your characteristic belatedness, for no one, no constraint in paradise or soil, can partition you from my love. Now emerge, fortified in that unwavering truth. Amplify this cherish you have gotten outward, conferring elegance to those who hurt you. I know you may not feel like excusing, however, and that is reasonable. Keep in mind, this is a travel, not a solitary occasion. Beauty streams delicately but tirelessly as a stream carves through stone. With time and care, the shake gives way. But remain persistent with yourself, my child. Child, rehash regularly this straightforward supplication. Help me need to need to forgive. I will honor this reinforcing in you the crave to break free of bitterness gravity. When flashes of torment or outrage emerge, let this basic supplication be the help drawing you back to me. As recuperating advances, you may all of a sudden long to accommodate broken ties, or you may feel at peace with keeping the remove intaglio. When severity no longer shrouds your vision, ponders show up on the skyline. Once clouded, companionship, community, Imagination, purpose, all these duplicate as absolution streams openly from you. Extend beauty liberally in each circumstance. Discharge desires regularly and delay habitually to recognize the gifts in and around you, my child. Implore regularly to end it up ever more mindful of my nearness, for I am closer than your another breath. Conversation truly with me, I get it the dialect of murmurs and tears. Calm your turning contemplations, welcoming quiet nearness. The way forward will reveal itself in due time. 
regularly in minutes of stillness. Maybe shockingly, you may feel stirrings calling you toward the way of benefit, looking for not awards but essentially to take off your corner of the world a bit brighter. In serving others, your blast of delight fills to flooding. This comes about from strolling the way of absolution loyally until you reach me, the source of all love. Here, at this put of reconnection, tap into the wellspring of elegance at your center. Drink profoundly the living waters of pardoning, mending, and unrestricted having a place. You you get a handle on at the edges of this vision, still battling to exemplify it day by day. Peace, my child. You are not alone. In spite of the fact that the way appears questionable, lift your eyes regularly to the light ahead. Fear not the shadows still prowling, torment cleared out unreconciled cannot take your legacy of delight. Let this statement consolation you in dangers of past enduring re-emerge, the light ahead burns more grounded than any obscurity behind. Discharge the recognizable weight of hatred as I take your hand once more. Permit me to direct your heart through mazes of recollections long spurned, exploring together what modern understanding comes to light. Here is prolific ground for forgiveness, roots to sink profound and bloom anew. See how the a long time of me entering this wild with me have enhanced your soul. The seeds of shrewdness planted indeed nowadays should bear much natural product, a hundredfold. Permit appreciation to swell up and spill over, let it lift trembling voices. At that point basically rest, my child. Rest in my solid grasp, for presently and continuously you are secure, you are chosen, you are cherished. You are named adored and chant of my heart. In this travel of absolution and mending, I welcome you to consider the significant effect of giving, of expanding yourself in acts of liberality that rise above simple exchange. This, my cherished, is where genuine change begins, not as it were in the soul of the collector but more altogether in the heart of the provider. Giving is in resound of my nature, a confirmation to the boundless cherish I have poured into creation. It is not simply around the exchange of assets but the sharing of oneself. Time, consideration, kindness, passion. These are the monetary standards of the divine economy, where venture yields returns of delight, peace and fulfillment past measure. In a world where shortage startles and storing comforts, I call you to a radical trust, a conviction, that giving does not exhaust but replenishes, that there is sufficient for all when hearts are open and hands are liberal. The act of giving, be it assets, time, or ability, is a statement of faith, a declaration that my arrangement is adequate and my guarantees are sure. And however, giving is not as it were approximately what you can offer to others, it is moreover around contributing in yourself in the development of your endowments and the stewardship of your assets for more prominent purposes. To contribute in oneself is not to surrender to self-centeredness but to recognize that you as well are a vessel of divine potential implied to be filled to flooding. It is by supporting your possessed development, by looking for intelligence and developing ethicalness, that you ended up able of more noteworthy generosity. The ethical esteem of giving, hence, is twofold. It asserts the nobility of the beneficiary, recognizing their worth and potential to rise over their circumstances. At the same time, he refines the supplier, chiseling absent the unpleasant edges of childishness and touching off the fire of kindness inside. It is not restricted to fabric help but includes the advertising of pardoning, the sharing of information, and the expansion of a tuning in ear. These are the blessings that frequently fetch small but cruel everything. As you walk with me, let your life gotten to be a waterway of liberality, streaming from the limitless source of my adore. Let giving be your delight and getting a humble acknowledgement of the beauty that ties us all. In doing so, you reflect the divine, getting to be conduits of my benevolence and planners of a more compassionate world. Keep in mind, my child, the degree you grant will be the degree you get back. 
The world educates you to calculate, pick up, and watch against misfortune. But I welcome you to a higher bookkeeping, where the money is a door and the profits are eternal. In this economy, the heart speculation in giving, giving, and contributing in oneself and others yield a gather of peace and satisfaction that outperforms all understanding. Let this shrewdness direct you as you explore the complexities of life. In minutes of choice, may the soul of liberality light your way. And in times of plenitude or require, may you continuously discover your heart tied down in the relentless truth that in giving we get, in excusing we are set free, and in adoring we come closest to the divine. So, my cherished, step forward with strength and confidence. Grasp the travel of giving, for it is in this act that you find the profundity of your quality and the breadth of your heart. In your look for more profound understanding, keep in mind that genuine giving starts inside oneself. As you develop intelligence and sympathy, it's fundamental to sustain the ethics that dwell in your heart. Commit yourself to self-reflection, acts of benevolence, and otherworldly development. Look for minutes of stillness to extend your mindfulness and appreciation. In times of trouble, ensure this inward development until it gets to be solid once more. My cherished child, incline in and listen the words I'm whispering to you presently. They carry more than consolation, they carry truth, quality. They are as imperative as your following breath. You have meandered through shadows, felt the weight of things inconspicuous, and inquired questions that have no simple answers. I see you, I feel the way your heart fixes beneath the weight, the way your soul extends, straining to hold on. The street has been long, and it has not been simple. But get at this, I am no stranger to this travel. I have felt the wild closing in, the sharpness of being tried, and the drag of enticement pulling at the edges of your mind. When I strolled through those forty days in the wild, I confronted the adversary's voice. He enticed me to allow into the wants of the substance, to abuse the control given to me. But I stood up to, not since I was safe to the battles of starvation, weariness, or the whispers of self-doubt, but since I knew the truth. The foe of your soul works the same way nowadays. He comes to you with lies advertising brief alleviation, wrong guarantees and bent truths. He tells you to yield to fear to begin with, to look for consolation in things that can never really satisfy. But, my child, you must stand up to, stand firm in the information of who you are and who I am. When I was enticed with starvation, the adversary said, turn these stones into bread. But I reacted, man does not live by bread alone, but by each word that comes from the mouth of God. This is the truth I need you to hold on to, your life, your food, your quality. It comes from me, not from the short-lived things of this world. The enemy's strategies haven't changed, but not one or the other has my truth. Each time you stand up to, he will escape, for he cannot stand against the control of truth that streams from me. You see, this life you're living is fair or arbitrary grouping of minutes, it's unpredictably woven with reason. Indeed, when you can't see it, there are minutes that feel moderate, extended, like time itself is holding its breath. In those delays, you ponder where this is all heading. But each step you take, indeed the ones that feel questionable, is portion of a plan much bigger than you can comprehend. I do not surge the work I'm doing inside you. I permit the quiet, the holding up, not since I've overlooked you, but since there's esteem in the pressure of those minutes. The calm times shape you in ways you might not recognize right presently, but you will. My child, come closer and listen to my voice. Click join to access my teachings and find strength in a family of believers who will stand with you. You are my cherished, and I am taking you from eminence to wonderfulness. You may feel like you're moving as well gradually, like advances happening quick sufficient, but I see the greater picture. 
I see the development happening in your soul, in your character. Each trial you confront, each challenge you overcome, lifts you higher. It makes you more grounded. I am filling you with my light, my cherish, and my intelligence so that when you stand in the places of impact I have arranged for you, you will sparkle brightly and pour out my cherish on all who come into your presence. But I require you to halt centering on what you think you need. Halt looking at your claim shortcomings, your confinements, your questions. I have never inquired you to fulfill anything in your possess quality. I am the one who works in and through you. I am the source of your quality. I am the one who brings the triumph. You may feel like you have so distant to go, like the travel is as well long, but take heart. Everything is unfurling concurring to my idealized plan. I get at the questions you have. I listen your heart crying out, when, master, when will things alter? When will the breakthrough come? But, my dear one, I am as of now at work. Indeed when you do not see it, indeed when it feels like nothing is happening, I am moving small by small. I am divulging the totality of what I have for you. My ways are not your ways, and my timing is not your timing, but I guarantee you I am never late. Each minute is flawlessly adjusted with the plans I have for you. You may not get it why I permit certain challenges, certain delays, but believe me, I am securing you from things you cannot see. I am forming you in ways you cannot however comprehend. I am keeping you humble, keeping pride from taking root in your heart. Pride has no put in the life I have arranged for you. I have chosen you for a reason. Fair as I chose Moses to lead my individuals. And fair like Moses, you may confront resistance, but I am with you. When Moses stood some time recently Pharaoh, he must have felt overpowered. He must have pondered how he seemed conceivably succeed in the confront of such control. But it was approximately Moses' quality. It was almost mine. Moses talked the words I gave him, let my individuals go. And indeed when Pharaoh's heart was solidified, I was in control. I utilized that circumstance to appear my control, to illustrate my steadfastness. In the conclusion, I conveyed my people. The same is genuine for you. The impediments you confront, the adversaries that appear so capable, will not win. Fair as I separated the ruddy ocean, and gulped up the adversaries of my individuals, I will make a way for you. The foes you see nowadays, whether they are physical challenges, otherworldly battles, or generational burdens, will not final. I will diffuse them, I will confound them, and I will turn their plans against them. I will bring you through each impossibility. My child, I need you to keep in mind my guarantees. I have not overlooked a single one. I said I would open the windows of paradise and pour out a favoring so awesome there would not be room sufficient to contain it, and I cruel that. But I require you to believe me. Believe that I am working indeed when you can't see it. Test me in this not with question, but with confidence. Observe as I supplant your need with my wealth. I am your supplier, and I will meet each require concurring to my wealth and glory. I know the travel has been long, but do not detest the little beginnings. The seeds of enormity are being planted in you, and they will bear natural product in time. Each step forward, no matter how little, is noteworthy. Do not search the handle. There is excellence in the moderate, unfaltering development. Before long sufficient, you will be running, and when you do, you will see back and see how distant I brought you. The trials will be behind you, and you will see the fulfillment of all I've promised. But indeed presently in the holding up, there is reason. I am educating you to believe me more profoundly, to depend on me more completely. The foe may attempt to debilitate you, but do not tune into his lies. You are not vanquished, you are not overlooked. I am with you, 
and I am working all things for your good. There will come a day when the assaults terminate, when the fear is gone, when your heart no longer trembles and your soul no longer feels dry. I will bring you into a put of peace, a put of rest. Fair as I conveyed Daniel from the lion's cave, I will convey you from each risk, each peril. I will protect you from the hand of the adversary and bring you into a put of victory. Rest in my guarantees, my child. My favor is upon you. My goodness and leniency are taking after you indeed presently. I am your guard, your shield. No weapon shaped against you will succeed. The plans I have for you are for great, to allow you a future filled with trust. You may not see the full picture, however, but I do. Believe me, you are venturing into a modern season, a season of fulfillment. You are strolling into the guarantees I have talked over your life. But as you enter this modern season, keep in mind that the arrive I am giving you is yours to claim. The adversaries that have possessed it, the questions, the fears, the ancient ways of thinking, must be confiscated. I am giving you the specialist to take back what has a place to you. It's time to step into your inheritance. I need you to drench yourself in my word, let it fill your heart and intellect. Contemplate on it day and night, and observe as it changes you. My word is living and dynamic, more honed than any two-edged sword. It will cut through the lies and bring clarity and disclosure. Talk my guarantees over your life. Indeed, when you do not see them, however, Talk them in confidence, knowing that I am steadfast to fulfill each word. My adored child, you are more valuable to me than you know. I have chosen you, called you by title, and set you separated for awesome things. You will total the race I have set some time recently you. You will wrap up solid. The deterrents in your way are transitory, but the triumph I have for you is interminable. Keep moving forward, keep sweet the enemy. You are closer than you think to seeing the fulfillment of my promises. I'm pulling you forward, but I require you to thrust as well. When you do, you'll discover yourself arriving at your goal quicker than you ever envisioned. My cherished child, I've been holding up for you, indeed from my position of royalty. I know the sentiments mixing in your heart, and it's vital for you to get at this. You must sense how great it is to be in my presence. Beloved child, I call you to grow in my love and truth. Subscribe and become part of a family that thrives in my grace, where my words will renew your heart and inspire your walk. Come to me, all of you who are exhausted and burdened. I will grant you rest. Learn from me, for I am tender and humble in heart. Yeah, I'll discover rest for your soul with me. My desires are sensible, and the weight I inquire you to bear is light. The minute of your mending has arrived. It's direct. There's no require to stay in obscurity. Shackled and removed from all you hold dear, beset by disgrace and misery. Return to me. It's only a choice to acknowledge my pardoning nowadays. It's essentially a choice to grasp the unused life I've created for you. Each day, he'll certify that you're welcome. He'll shower you with veneration. The magnificent blessed messengers cheer for all those who are true, those who reach out their souls toward a door, goodness, and healing. But for those who endeavor to constrain you back into your ancient ways, for those who attempt to burden you with pointless weight, you will pronounce, My God is generous. I am excused. My past is erased. Whoever rejects you or denies to pardon you will reply to me. But you have invigorated yourself through confidence, and you draw boldness from my divine quality. So proceed on your way. Observe how, after hearing this message, your soul is elevated, your face brightens, and your inward being takes off higher than some time recently. Day by day, your soul develops, your confidence in me deepens, I will commune with your soul, warm your heart, and wrap you in my cherish, filling you with my soul. I cherish you. I favor you. 
I celebrate that you've come to visit me. I have been foreseeing your entry from my position of royalty. I feel the feeling streaming from your heart upon the daybreak of each modern day. I reaffirm my cherish for you when my voice rouses you from rest. You sense my nearness. I instill profound peace inside you through the tranquility of my quality. I direct you through my voice. This is what I've arranged indeed some time recently the world's foundation, this gigantic ador in which I have chosen you. Do not be anxious. Dry your on-edge tears, they do not overwhelm you. You want ended up oppressed to fiendish fears, surrendering your soul to the devourer of dreams. Lose hope will not inundate you. I guarantee you of extraordinary security. Have confidence. See upward and comprehend what the challenges in your life are planning you for. Hold on to this trust and the dynamic, bubbling feeling that makes you accept you can soar. As you wake each morning, sense my grasp around you, tending to your soul, assembly each require. Keep in mind, I've called you a brave warrior for endless a long time, days and evenings for various fights, and to be a steward of compelling favors. The light inside you was implied to sparkle in the world's haziness, directing others to witness the ponders I can perform in their lives, bringing eminence to my title. I've as of now set the date of your triumph, your tears will change into delight in a moment. Indeed when it appears him quiet, when it shows up him not working to favor you in ways you've however to get it, question may crawl in. The trickster may come camouflaged as a cherished one. The informer may approach like a kin when you slightest anticipate it. The informer thumps at the entryway of your dreams, spreading lies, deriding your confidence and disparaging your goals. Question whispers, you are separated, God is not with you. Question points to occupy your consideration from the bolts of your genuine foe needing you to just tend to the wounds from this suffering. Place your certainty in me and my word. The bolts of this world are bound with passing, question and lose hope. But review how I strolled adjacent to you through the dull valley. Do not disregard how you drawn closer me, full of confidence and regret. At that point I freed you from the weight of your blame and acquitted your transgressions. I emphasize, my blessed messengers encompass you, you rest in the shield of my security. So let your foes seethe and rage, let them throw their dangers at you. Let them offended and danger you to betray you. What can they genuinely do to you? Their apprehensive dangers can never puncture your heart. Let them do what they will, I can shake the sky and soil to rebuff those who set out to hurt you. My blessed messengers stand watch, they'll protect against anybody who endeavors to off-base you or abuse your confidence. For as you dismiss viciousness and depend on my adore, as you get a handle on my hand in the night's obscurity, you illustrate your liberal advertising of confidence, boldness, and perseverance. I charm in seeing your confidence, your bravery, and your relentlessness. The reality is that I am here, I will not spurn you, fair as a dear companion would never desert you. Overcome fiendish with great, do not let eagerness and presumption corrupt your soul. Welcome me into your considerations, do not lose heart. You may be enduring presently, but before long I will wipe absent your distresses and re-establish your fortunes. Have no fear, your noxious enemies will disappear. My radiance will defend you unceasingly. They print these words on your heart and intellect. Share them with your children. Talk of them at domestic and on your travel, when you lie down and when you rise. Discharge your stresses. Bring your concerns to me in supplication and supplication. My peace, which outperforms all understanding, will watch your heart and mind. Remember who I am. I am the master, your God. You have a place to me. Your cherished ones are mine. All might be well with you. I know your heart's most profound wants, the desires you've harbored for a long time, the whispered supplications for your family. I take note of everything. 
you snicker. There is a season for each reason beneath paradise. I will supplicate for you, to favor you, to clear your way, to improve your confidence and understanding, to make you shrewd and humble, to increment your tolerance. You are my child, and I cherish you gigantically. Indeed, presently, I send my blessed messengers ahead of you to get ready a table for you in the nearness of your adversaries. Take heart, cling to the gifts found in my heavenly and powerful word. Get a handle on it with all your might and approach me boldly. Precious child, take this message I have given you and pass it to those who seek my light. Share it with three souls who are longing for hope, and you will bless them in my name. I offer elegance upon the humble. Come to me and get me. Ought to your past be perplexed with disappointments. Ought to you have missed your step and run off track. Still hold quick to these expressions. Say this presently, from this minute forward, my life and my family will be favored, my future guaranteed. Pronounce with me that my word will never come up short. In my guarantees, unceasing life proliferates with affirming ponders and answers. When you feel incapable to move forward, there is a sacred text to share that appears you how to triumph. Studied your sacred text frequently, as you examined. Sit next to me. I will stand by your side, one word at a time, filling you with my nearness so y'all know me and never question the persevering nature of my door or fear pulverization for your mistakes. I want to stay in your heart. When you grasp me, y'all discover your natural travel filled with endowments, beauty, and unfaithful reason outlined for you and your family, expecting for no other. Be not anxious. I have evacuated fear distant from you. Brithenly put your certainty completely in me. Depend not on your possess understanding. In all your ways recognize me, and I will direct your way. My adoring benevolence toward you is more noteworthy than the sky. It comes to the clouds. My adored, what inconvenience is you that you run distant from me? I spared you from express demolish. I am the god of control the God of truth. I lift the misplaced and the bruised, I elevate the frail and those who sob. All who walk in the completion of me, who cherish me with heart and soul, I will open the sky to those who esteem tolerance, regard, and those who turn absent from prattle and wrong teachings. My cherished child, my words dwell in your intellect and heart from this day forward until the day we are rejoined. My words are sweet to you, my words construct you up and fortify you. My words will go with you in each circumstance, all over. With my words, you will be able to confront each adversary and overcome each foe. My words will stand as an ensured boundary in each trial of your life. My words will offer assistance you rise above each antagonistic circumstance, and my word will protect you all through life. No foe will overcome you nor will you ever gotten to be caught in temptation. I will favor you and exalt you with otherworldly vision and otherworldly eyes that permit you to see and involvement my boundless eminence and my world of inexhaustible favoring. Indeed, if you cannot see it with your common eyes, I am your defensive shield, your quality, and your asylum. The foe may wage war against you, but I pronounce that he will not prevail you. He needs the control to hurt you. My defense of nearness covers you. Be careful of your activities, be cautious of what you watch. Talk with thoughtfulness. Do not be incited by incitements. In reaction to each trial, bear natural product with a soul of delicacy, and in that hour, my peace should stay in your house. At that point might your endowments increase, plenitude should flood, and your confidence might be as a mustard seed that develops into a compelling tree. Your family will be filled with delight. I will once more illustrate my cherish to you, and you will be with me always. To those who look for me each morning, who near their eyes and reach into the quiet, grasping me and anticipating my reaction, do not ever lose heart. I listen your faith, your wonderful, effective faith, and it opens my heart to adore you, to recuperate your past distresses 
to let you know how you are until the end of time cherished. I need you to resign each night with bliss and stir with a firm conviction that your tomorrow will outperform your recently. At this minute, I grasp you with my cherish, my hands upon your head, my favors for your considerations and activities, my ador poured upon you in all my secrets, my light sparkling upon you and directing you in all you do. I will favor you and in fact shock you, but you must continue on. You require not talk. Lower your eyes and essentially get all my cherish. Take it in and savor it. Appreciate these words and may a significant delight well up in your heart. I call upon your peace and success. I summon your well-being, your companions and family. I call them. I call them with flooding wealth. And you, my adored, if you feel little, if you feel underappreciated, especially when you see others surging around and filling their lives with fabric things, know that you have something more important than gold in your soul. You know me, you gave your heart to me. I have depended you with get to. Whereas numerous vacillate, you succeed. You can reach out to me at any time and I will be there. I will open your closed entryways and direct you towards unused ways along predominant ways to travel. Never want anything for others and never envy their good for nothing wanderings. In spite of the fact that they may be charming, they eventually lead to annihilation. Walk tall, knowing you do not require to all anybody to be in my locate. You know what is composed in my word. Your doors are wide open, it is your house. You will be tuned into with persistence and adore. No place else is so unadulterated and significant. I cherish you. You cannot comprehend the profundity of my adore. If you accept in my word to the conclusion, and if you stand in me, it is my want, my choice. I will re-establish to you the wealth of heaven. I am the maker of paradise and soil, the ocean and everything in them. I am the God of the incomprehensible. I make all things modern, the restoration and the life. Do not fear passing, nor overcome, nor malady. I will recuperate you and lift you from lose hope and pity. Believe me and see, I will change everything. When you accept in me, when you confront unfavorably chances, when the oceans appear closed, when the mountains tower heavenward and you fear you cannot climb, observe as my hands move. Observe as I portion the oceans for you and permit you to tread upon the waters. Dear child, if this message has moved your spirit, Express your faith and let others see my love through your actions. I will donate you wings to fly, to rise, to overcome. I am giving you wings to connect with me in wonderful places where my favored and favors flourish. So do not regard the words of obscurity. Do not acknowledge the words of lose hope. Do not accept the words of disappointment. I am your light. I have set my light interior you. And when I put my light interior you, you will be able to sparkle. I am a fire that burns and filters so that your heart may endure nothing from this world. Neither distress, misfortune, remorse, botch, rebuke, criticize, show disdain toward hopelessness, nor mistreatment. Nothing should be in your heart but me and my truth. Look at your hands, through your hands, in your working and drudging, I will perform ponders. See at your reflection. What do you see? You see my cherished child who is looking back at you, earnestly, devoutly, who is really looking for me, who needs me presently. Accept in the future and hold on to my promises. Today I favor you. My wish is that your heart and soul flood with bliss and peace. Take boldness nowadays. Know that you are beneath my mindful care and security. If nowadays you feel a small down, you can feel elevated. Nowadays depend on me, let my warm cherish stream into you. Be at peace, sweet child. All of this will pass, and things will be well before long. Unwind and free your disturbed intellect. Near your eyes and let my soul energize you. 
Sing the melodies you were born to sing. Inundate yourself in my adore. We guaranteed that everything will begin to progress, and you will be free of the turmoil that torments you. Honor and eminence will be yours. You must proceed to lead the way for your cherished ones. There will be challenging times and difficulties. I am portion of your getting to be. Keep in mind this. You are encompassed in my adore. Range for anything may come. Don't be panicked or dismal nowadays. I am you, and however I am so much more since I made adore in you and made you competent of adore and, subsequently, competent of withstanding all things, of overcoming all impediments set in your way. I am close to you. Your contemplations are mine. Your wishes are mine. I know the sweetness of your dreams and the ventures upon which you work to improve the world. You are valuable to me, and I have guaranteed that the spring morning and evening of your life will bloom over and over once more. Indeed, when you are distant from my look, my grin enlightens you. My child, I adore you and I favor you. My eye see you and my quality favors you. You will be a light in the haziness. Those who look for me will discover you. Be solid. Examine this. Accept this. Depend on me. For I will stand with you through each trial, for you are mine. You are ordained for triumph. I have awesome things in store for you, and no one can modify that. Keep in mind, I am the starting and the conclusion, the Alpha and the Omega. I have known you since some time recently time started, and I will cherish you long after time ceases to exist. Each minute of your life, each delight and each distress, is known to me and as meaning, my cherished child. In the profundities of your heart, I listen you, I get at your fears. In spite of the fact that your voice may tremble, it comes to me clearly. Know that I am continuously with you mindful to each whisper of your soul. Nowadays, I react to you. In this minute, I meet your each require, both known and obscure. Indeed, if you feel misplaced in vulnerability, I encompass you with my unflinching nearness. When you feel covered up or neglected, keep in mind that nothing get away my take no. I am personally mindful of all that happens in your life and inside your family. Your travel unfurls some time recently me each minute filled with reason. I call you presently to fortify your confidence. Proceed to interface with me day by day, for each word we share brings peace to your soul and shrewdness to your intellect. The challenges you confronted have not been good for nothing. Each battle in question has served a more prominent reason. Presently, I bring forward the wonder you've anticipated. With immovable confidence, Rise up and dry your tears. Excuse those who have wronged you, for absolution leads to opportunity. Approach me with certainty, for I have arranged plenitude particularly for you. Nowadays, I allow you quality more noteworthy than you've known, lifting you over the reach of your enemies. No longer will mortification touch you. I opened some time recently you a entryway of trust, wide and welcoming, prepared to get the gifts, openings, and answers that anticipate you. Your eyes, once filled with distress, will flood with delight as my soul fills your heart. Stand tall, wipe absent the remainders of your tears and walk toward me with the certainty of one who is profoundly cherished. I have named you for extraordinary reason. Open your eyes wide and see the endowments that will encompass your life. I will uncover significant truths and insider facts that talk of my persevering adore for you. My cherish will grasp you, re-establishing you totally. This adore will fill each portion of your being, heart, soul, body, and intellect, and will flood copiously. Look for me day by day, for I long to talk with you, to whisper words of consolation into your heart. Know that I am prepared in a moment to act on your sake. I long to appear you, in both terrific and inconspicuous ways, how much you cruel to me. My words recuperate your disturbed considerations, facilitating the wounds cleared out by past disillusionments. 
They wash acid laments and light up the potential of what your life can gotten to be. You know that I adore you. And I will proceed to appear you not out of commitment, but since I need you to feel the profundity of my fondness. If you permit yourself to adore me completely and submissively, you will find that my adore is the key to your opportunity. It opens the chains of fear, question, and self-reproach that have held you back. Maybe you've been told you're unworthy of great things, that endowments are for others, not you. In these minutes, consider carefully whom you believe. Those who dishearten you are regularly caught in their possessed haziness, denying the plausibility of transformative adore. Their cynicism require not characterize your reality. Don't take after the way of sharpness. It leads to missed openings and misplaced gifts. Dear one, if my message has filled your heart with joy and hope, let it be known. Press the like button as a sign of your embrace of my love. My heart floods with thoughtfulness toward you, a kindness that never blurs. Remove yourself from those who would lead you adrift with pessimism. You don't require their endorsement. I have as of now announced you valuable. I talk to you doubtlessly to guarantee you get it. My words enlighten your way. I stand prepared to lift you from lose hope, but you must select to reach for my hand. Select to have confidence, to grasp my lessons, and let them take root in your heart. My arms are open, my heart ever open to you. Come to me, exhausted one. I see the burdens you carry, the weight that presses upon you. I long to donate you rest, to lift those burdens and supplant them with peace. Your enemies may stay on the past, looking for to tie you to ancient botches, but I announce that the past is behind you. Enter into a modern reality where elegance proliferates. I give up washes absent all wrongdoings, casting them aside until the end of time. There's no require to stay on past wounds or let lament be your companion. I offer you flexibility from blame and disgrace re-establishing your soul and bringing unused life to places long burdened by torment. Take off behind your ancient life in the turmoil of past considerations. In trade, I deliver you unused life, dynamic and full of plausibility. Discover your rest in the protect of my beauty. What you cannot do for yourself, I will do. In spite of the fact that you confront misfortune, know that I am your asylum your secure harbor. I will battle on your sake. When your quality falls flat, peace is closer than you accept. I see your boldness vacillating, your quality melting away. Presently is the time for divine mediation, for rest from the battles that have wearied you. You don't require to demonstrate yourself. I am here to direct you to still waters. I work energetically for your great. Indeed, when you don't see it, Rest in my nearness and know that I am with you. Calm your on edge contemplations. You've went through as well long looking for consolation in your claim understanding. Permit my soul to relieve your intellect, encompassing you in a calm that outside circumstances cannot aggravate. Take shield in my nearness. Here, you will discover asylum from the storms around and inside you. Don't be on edge approximately the fights in your intellect. When seeking after my peace, it's not a peace that overlooks strife, but one that rises above it, unshaken and peaceful. Stand up to the enticement to lose hope. Haziness may contradict our closeness, but nothing can isolated you from my cherish. When question and fear emerge, call on me, and I will reply. In that minute, the fight gets to be mine. Your part is to believe, to stand firm knowing I fight for you with profound cherish. Your title, joined together with mine, holds control that resounds unceasingly in time. All will recognize this truth. Those who once denied it will recognize the reality they ignored. Keep in mind that you are valuable to me. Your worth isn't decided by accomplishments, status, or other suppositions, but by my perpetual adore. Walk certainly, knowing you are cherished past degree. 
Let my cherish be the establishment of your life, the focal point through which you see yourself and the world. As you travel through life with this message in your heart, may you discover quality for each modern day. My child, don't let this be a one-time thing. Come to me every day. Let me remind you of my unfailing love, of the grace that is waiting for you. Let me heal the deepest parts of your heart, the places that are still hurting. I want to walk with you, guide you, comfort you, and show you the way forward, step by step. No matter what you're facing, no matter how heavy your burdens, I am here. I will never leave you. I will never stop loving or forgiving you. And my child, know this, every day I am speaking to you through this channel. Every single day I am bringing you messages of hope, love, and forgiveness. If you are tired of feeling lost, overwhelmed, or burdened, this is the place where you will find my peace. Make this channel your daily habit, because right here is where you will hear my voice, guiding you, healing you, and reminding you that you are never alone. So, hit that subscribe button and bell icon, my child. If you truly want to experience my love, my grace, and my forgiveness every single day, this is where you need to be. Let my words fill your heart and lift your spirit every day. Amen.